Hello, Pestness everyone. Is... Hello. Hello. Greetings. Good um... evening. Wait, I, I'm on the edge of my seat. Mm. One level past this is what? I don't know. I die probably. Yeah, probably. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Continue, Brett. Uh, that that was it. Good, 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 uh, good day. Good, uh, good evening. Good day. Mm. Good day. I'm on my top voice projection mode to carry the other. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be honest. I'm running a little dry on funny See, anecdotes for this one. The cool one is Brett knows how to RP my character so well. Right on. That he <laughs> can just take the reins if like I have to step away. It's yes. very cool. I have absolute confidence in him. Thank you. Thank you. Thank can you we get much. a... A bow impersonation? Mm, yes. Stretches around. <laughs> Stretches. Okay, yep, got yeah. it. Nailed it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Stretches. Tips for Dora. Hey, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Wraps around you like the oh. fucking snake from the jungle Wraps book. Wraps around you. <laughs> yep. From Jungle Book. Jesus. Wraps around you. <laughs> okay. Good. Oh, my Jesus. That was Come good. On. That was good. Come on. Oh. Come on. I'm on my top game here. Uh, uh, I'm mid mid salad eating. It's fucking got to be, dude. I'm <laughs> mid salad eating. Come on, man. You're baby. doing great, okay? Woo! Oh, man's absolutely <laughs> bringing the funny. So, uh, yes, uh, chat, I've got tomato at max volume. He's going to be a little bit quiet. I swear to God, if one of you goes. I can turn my mic up more. Ooh. Well, thank you. Wow, I, that's in my brain. That actually mm -hmm. works really well. Then I can but I mean, it, it won't help with how fucking bassy my voice is just going to sound from. Oh, it's, My you sound horrible. fine. You sound fine. You don't sound peaky. You you sound great. Cool, I think I cool. I think I asked someone to turn up their volume once, and they're like, "Man, I gotta fuck with my settings." And I went, "Oh," and then after that, I was like, "Oh, don't worry about it. Never mind." It's like, "Nope, too late. Already turned. <laughs> already fucked with things." I was like, "No," and I felt so bad. <laughs> I felt terrible. Cause you never, yeah, as someone who was dealing with uh, with audio settings prior. Like I sound, I sound, I think I sound pretty good on stream. I know I sound a lot quieter on Discord, but it was either be louder on Discord, but peaky on stream or sound great on stream. Dude, and I sound, sound like shit over, di like I sound like shit in the VODs uh, for Pipe Dreamers, but I'm hoping, like I got a new mic recently, so I'm hoping Ooh. it's not as shit. To be fair, one of, I'm, a couple of your sessions, I think you were uh, like, Somewhere on a phone yeah, yeah but that's so. that was a that was like one session a super oh. super long time ago oh yeah he's, he, I, I think everyone sounds fine i think okay. everything is good uh also we have uh Masay's character karis who will be joining us uh today because uh um Drask was like, I'm going to go check out these guys and make sure they don't fuck up. So he just kind of left everyone. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's chaperoning them. Boy, wow. We really, <laughs> yeah. we really set Drask to chaperone them. Yeah. Well, I think, I think he said, I think he sent himself. I wouldn't be surprised if Drask was like in the bar with you guys and he's like, Hey, one sec. I'll be right back. And then he just leaves with everybody. Like, doesn't tell anybody. I love that. Oh, my him. God. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's exactly what's going to happen. Oh, boy. All right. Let's go ahead and get started because we got a lot to do uh, today. Uh, I don't think we'll have the same, you know, food talk and all that stuff. I don't think we're going to have the time to do that today. Uh, so <clears throat> where we last left off. Uh, you all were currently planning on departing uh, this place and heading over uh, potentially to look for your ship, the ticket, um, but also try and figure out, you know, what the heck was going on with the kidnapping, uh, what the heck of the mayor, what the heck was going on in Clayberry, and just hearing all of these dreadful rumors of potentially what might be happening in Clayberry has lit a fire under some of your butts of uh, like, hey, we need to return. We need to go ahead and stop this shit because as Zug has stated, Clayberry was his home. Well, uh, fortunate for you all, a group of, excuse me, uh, a group of, what's the word I'm looking for? Not escapees. Uh, 
Refugees. Refugees? Ref not refugees. Fugitives. Criminals. Fugitives. Oh, Thank you. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. A group of fugitives were flying off over to the north from Clayberry, uh, arriving here in Bashar. Uh, Dr. Oshi went ahead, was a little bit inquisitive about these uh, fugitives, uh, and wanted mainly to know what the heck is going on um, in Clayberry. So, um... So was it a group of deadbeats? That's correct. Uh, so these deadbeats, right? Uh, they they arrived over here in Bashar. People were aware, of like, hey, let's go ahead and exchange some notes. Let's go ahead and, and see what exactly is happening. And so Dr. Roshi uh, met up with the fugitives, uh, tried to get you guys to go along as well, just to gather the information. Because they were fugitives, uh, you guys were a little on edge. They were also on edge for being fugitives. Um, but a meeting took place over in the dump where you guys exchanged uh, pleasantries, he says in air quotes, uh, but also kind of like shared a little bit of information that was going on. Uh, the Deadbeats told you guys um, that they were currently on the case pursuing uh, Ganymedians, and after you guys exchanged illusions of Ganymedians that you've spotted, aka Talon, uh, you realized that you guys were facing the same enemy. Uh, more importantly, the subsection, you guys end up learning that the slimes uh, seem to have splintered off from the facade faction of the Ganymedians and seem to be doing their own thing. After exchanging a bit of notes with the deadbeats, you guys have discovered that the slimes are heading over uh, to the Arkmon reactor to the south, where Zug theorizes, as well as Oshi at this point, that they are planning potentially to blow it up uh, creating a genocide of a mass scale of the city of Arkmond in the hopes to reproduce their slimy cells by using uh, the fallen bodies of those that would have met their demise due to the Arkmond reactor's meltdown. And so, Dr. Oshi comes up with a plan after making con uh, after reaching out to a couple of contacts that you guys need to head over, and you guys agreed this together, you all need to head over to Arkmon to stop this. Stop the slime menace from uh, um, infiltrating the Arkmon reactor. Um, potentially save Arkmon, save Kathos, and maybe even save all of Aya. So, Dr. Oshi has hatched a plan after speaking with several contacts. Uh, clearly, just walking there through the waypoint is a no-go, uh, because Arkmon is a severely uh, militarized uh, city. Which means it just, uh, hold on one second. Sorry, I'm just checking uh, on something there. Okay. Uh, so, as you guys were continuing, just, just figuring these things out, um, Arkmon is a militarized zone, which means uh, that you will not be able to go through just either through the checkpoint, uh, you won't be able to fly over there, um, and you guys would essentially, if you try to fly over there or head over there, you'd be shot down by the armed forces of the Arkmon army. Um, so, you guys are going to have to head out on foot, uh, and you have split up the task. Uh, half of you We'll be going through the uh, the Sparklight Mines, uh, while the other half will be uh, taking the assault on uh, Mount Ark itself, crossing through there. This is a two-point thing because there's a lot of tech involved, uh, allowing you to sneak through uh, the militarized zone, the defensive grid. Uh, by crossing through Mount Ark, you all would discover you all would have to cross through a uh, defensive grid where you all would potentially uh, be at risk or get in trouble and, and get caught essentially by the military of Arkmond. So the idea is uh, that one group heads through Mount Ark to create an opening for the other group in the Sparklight Mines uh, to cross through and get through some, some more of like the back end mines areas that will hopefully cross through Mount Ark and head you over to Arkmond. The party in the mines uh will be doing a little bit of hacking as well to temporarily create an opening in the defensive grid uh for the individuals m marching down uh marching through mount arc and uh yeah so that is it's a two-pronged attack where both of you will need to succeed if one party fails the other party will have to deal with um great and heavy consequence probably from a heavy heavily uh, militarized force. 
Uh, specifically on the mine front, uh, Dr. Oshi has informed you um, that there is a section of the mines that have been sealed off uh, because of a failed project uh, that was supposed to automate the mining process, essentially eliminate the need for human work factor or humanoid work factor uh, and have uh, machines uh, mine section of the mines. Uh, this was a failure. Uh, so the section had been completely uh, sealed off, uh, but this would also be the best way to go through the workings uh, of the mines, sneak through and end up on the other side with the assumption that the deadbeats have opened up a gate uh, for you guys to cross through. That was a lot of information. I apologize for the info uh, vomit and the info dump. Um, but uh, yeah, do you guys have any questions or anything that I can clear up? I would be happy to address them to you. Or was that pretty much it? Ready to rock. That's good to me. I'm it just gonna wing sense it. sense to me, Brett. Okay. Yes. Excellent. Good. Good. Yes. Yes. So. Is there an echo in here? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. I see what you're. Uh, I see what you're doing there. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just, I'm just fucking obsessed with the slimy bow voice. <laughs> yes. Um. Okay. So. <laughs> um. So everyone in their respective parties are currently discussing and, and, and talking with each other. Uh, you'll actually see Dash and Karis has uh, left um, to have a bit of a conversation for themselves. Uh, while everyone else, uh, yeah, sort of has this discussion and dialogue. Um, meanwhile, uh, Dr. Oshi is over with uh, you guys, uh, kind of like going over the plans. And I think talking more to Zug. The idea of hack of going of creating an opening in the defensive grid uh, would involve a lot of uh, hacking from those that are familiar with the technical know-how. So, Dr. Oshi's kind of got some schematics of some designs of the automated uh, mining system uh, and potentially how you guys might be able to create a feedback loop in the defensive grid itself. You guys are kind of like trying to figure out a way to hack into the defensive grid. Um, since that seems to be the best way to go about easy, it. Easy peasy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Smash his head against control board. <laughs> <laughs> and then he'll go, yes, but I suppose with this and over here, we could activate the following uh, feedback loops in this area and this. And he's just kind of like pointing at various like wire, de like wire areas um, where... Uh, the idea is to send enough power to the defensive grid that it just kind of like it deactivates it for a brief moment of time in where you guys will be crossing over. So, um, what the heck? Sorry, uh, my Discord was like, "Hey, guess what? You know, like, hey, check this out. Um, the Spotify, Spotify's here. Woo!" So, but uh, but yeah. Anyways, um, so as he's talking you guys are discussing you guys are currently within the dump uh oh yeah that's right we have a confused slime don't we Give we do oh yeah we do have a little confused guy yeah so if you guys are going the yeah. same day you're gonna have to yeah how do we feel about uh long resting before we do this did the other party long rest would we know that uh so you guys would did have... we have a long oh maybe not so you did you did complete your long rest, which is why you've got the confused slime. Now here's where it gets interesting. Uh, the other party uh, and you guys are charging right now. So the slime that you have is gonna be the slime that you are unfortunately going into the mines to. Because if you just, oh, we can let <laughs> put, them it, put no, it no, down, no, cool. we can let them die. Yeah, uh, that down. doesn't matter to if me. You got, uh, Old Yeller the thing. But it's, uh, yes, if you do take a long rest, it will be out of sync from where the other party's going, uh, meaning they uh, will okay. cross through to the defense grid and have to deal with the militarized force upon you. Ultimately, up to you. Slime looks up Just over sacrifice him. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe we should stay in sync. I feel like that just makes things easier, you know? Yeah. There's not a guarantee list. Look, I've seen confusion. I used it a lot as a goblin. Mm -hmm. That shit only hits maybe one every ten times. That slime's okay. gonna be fine. Okay, it's fine. He'll it work. Looks up over Someone needs to carry him though. 
Yeah. Does someone want to carry him? I'm good for you. Oh, pass. No. If he has to use his own legs, it's going to be way harder because that's a whole thing with the with the confusion. Why, why can't you carry him? I can't do that. Bo starts to try to like wrap around him, but he just like gets more radiation and his fur is singeing off. Ow! What? Bo is gonna fucking die. <laughs> Bo's gonna be fine. Bo's a goner. They're gonna be fine. Oh, I've got it. Bo mm -hmm. gets his shield from off of his back and he That's puts so it on smart. the ground. Oh, like a bowl. Mm -hmm. so gestures. Like a small confused cat, it'll like slowly roll <laughs> onto there. Uh, and as it does that, it will. Uh, one second. Uh, try to smack Bo across the face. What? Failing miserably. It then deflates on the shield. Did anyone see that? Bo looks at the, the bomb. Bomb shrugs. Cool, cool, cool. And then shrugs <laughs> almost like a reflex. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Yeah, it just kind of just... It just kind of deflates over on the shield a little bit. And, um, yeah. And, and once it's there, you'll just kind of see Dr. Oshi give a sigh and go, right. Um, he looks over at the bar to see Dash and Karis talking. And then will just give a sigh and say, I suppose I should see what they're up to so we can go ahead and depart. Are we sure we want Drass to go with the, with, with, with the, uh, I have the, full the confidence lives. in my spot checker. Hmm. He looks over at, uh, he, he'll look over. At this point, Drask is just like sitting over at the bar and uh, sulking a little bit and goes, well, I suppose. And uh, I'm just worried about that one. Lots of rumors about her, but hmm. I suppose rumors are just that. We should make assumptions. Very well. I'll go collect her. And you'll just kind of watch as Dr. Roshi walks by to go ahead and get Karis. I'm going to kick my boots up on the counter. Mm -hmm. Drask. Ah, what the fuck? Who moved Drask? I did. <laughs> it's like, it's this me. is like seeing a ghost. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, after a, a small conversation happens there, uh, what are the rest of you guys doing? Um, I had a project to work on, didn't I? I would love to have that sorted, like all the materials I need so I can work on it for this journey. Okay, what project would you be working on? I for wasn't it one of the items I had needed to work or God, I forget. I also forget. I forgot. We had right. the giant gun, but that's kind of not something we can bring with us. Yeah, we do have a giant gun that we probably can't take with. Oh, also, the seismic stompers are still in my inventory, if you want to put them in. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, did, yeah, yeah. You yeah. did give her those easy. I do that still think correct. Felsic should be wearing the bo the bonus action attack boots if she runs I 20 just, feet, I just, which I, was, like, an incredibly good I don't know. I'm going to be honest. I, like, I like couldn't remember if we actually picked those up or not. You did. Well, Matter of uh, fact, I, the, apparently the wiki has it documented as you having it, but somehow your sheet shit. doesn't. Holy shit. I don't know. I forgot. Um, <laughs> Bro, we're starting out so strong today. I mean, I think that's better for Drask. Uh, Drask is already using his bonus action because he has a. Uh, fuck! His, uh, okay, it's sorry. Sorry, I got a little passionate for a second. Because uh, <laughs> she can't do bonus action attacks with a two handed weapon. So. Okay, how about. I'm going to sort this out later, maybe. Yeah, that's how about good. that. Yeah. Sure. You have them now. Okay, thank you. But you, do have the, you do have these these boots on you currently. Yeah, I gotta just add When them can to the my bomb inventory. wear boots? Uh, magic, yeah, magic boots anytime. That is okay. Correct. I don't know why this closed. Um, but, uh, but yes. Okay, I'm gonna sound so dumb and I'm so sorry. Where can I find the equipment list? Because oh. I'm trying to add it. 
to my character sheet on D&D uh, &D Beyond. The Seismic Stompers, it's over in loot when it needs to be over in your equipment. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, yes, uh, it also requires two minutes. Give me one second. Mr. Sense. Brett, I, I remembered when you're ready. Uh, thank you. Yeah, give me one quick second. Because apparently if I create this as loot, uh, it doesn't, I can't make it function any uh, other way. So I have I to see. like manually enter. Yeah, sometimes it do be like that. Okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba, seismic stompers. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Equipment. And rare. And this requires attunement. You are going to be attuned and equipped. So there it is. So over in your equipment section, you should see seismic stoppers. This is your second uh, item that you have attuned upon you. Uh, the first oh. being bracers okay. of defense, which gave you plus two bonus to AC. Okay. I. All right. That's that's goodbye me. Goodbye you. Uh, I can't. I, I'm. It's not. It's not in the equipment list. I can't add it. <laughs> Am I missing something? I'm confused. Oh, are you looking at D&D Beyond? This is a custom yeah. piece of loot, which means I have not added it to D&D Beyond. Okay, it's on okay. It's your Foundry character sheet. Okay, all right. Yeah. Sure. That That's probably what has really been throwing me. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, I don't. I do not touch your your D and D Beyond sheet. I I I anything okay. I edit, Got I edit it. Yep, live yep, 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 yep. Foundry. Okay, cool. All awesome. good. Cool, 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 cool. Um. I bet yes, it. yes, yes. Uh, what are you working on, Zug? My gauntlet. I forgot. Uh, from the schematics found. That's in right. That's what you were doing. You, you were trying to. Yeah. Uh, you were trying to alternate that. Okay. Give me one second. I have to go yeah. to a completely different form for that. Boop, 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 boop. It was, I believe, between two things, or maybe three. I uh, uh I have, I have it documented. Now that yes. I know, that I know, I have documented. Um, also for the, where the heck? Oh, that's right. I have it on a dock. I've got so much stuff everywhere. I apologize. Uh, I'm yeah. Hold on a minute. I'm taking the 88 pound toilet out of my inventory. <laughs> oh yeah, you fucking took that <laughs> enough toilet. Of, enough of this. I'm so <laughs> tired. I, why you did just... we take that? <laughs> we ship. needed it for the ship because we don't have one. <laughs> We've been pissing out the window, Bo. <laughs> All right. Uh, give me a moment. You really could have gotten around faster if you weren't carrying that toilet up. <laughs> I could get around plenty fast. This is nothing, but it is 88 pounds. <laughs> No, I got this. It's really good. Uh, it's just like carrying around this toilet everywhere. Uh, okay, gloves are swimming hard. Dust of corrosion. Yeah, uh, oh, that's right. The rare. The um. Oh yeah, we'll figure it. We'll, we'll we'll figure that out later at the end here. But I do have everything there, so we can double check on that at a later time. Um, as far as yes, uh, modify fire bolt to a fire spray or fire bolt to a magma ball. So you can either turn it into a co uh your you can alternate your fire bolt into a uh, cone spray or you can alternate it into a small like little mini fireball mm. which one were you interested in alternating i think i'm gonna go with fireball it's hard oh. to pass that one up well so by small fireball i mean it turns into you can alternate your fire bolt into a magma ball which is a 60 foot range and a 10 foot area cube cube with dexterity saving throw it'll still do the same damage or you can alternate to a fire spray which is a which 15 is foot cone cone yeah yeah the same damage but you're gonna do with a mag magma ball uh cantrip um yes i would like to all right go ahead and give me a use of your tinkers tools the use of my tinker tools you say go Uh, unfortunately, you are unable to succeed at this project. That's okay. You can try again tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, bud. No worries. No worries. Yikes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Just both say that. It's both like, yikes. <laughs> Damn. Do a yikes. better. Yikes. Um, if, if, 
<laughs> in in <laughs> character, Zug's like on a bench with like a light focused on the the gauntlet, working with like really tiny tools to, you know, get around these small like soldering wires and stuff. And I was just watching over his shoulder, and then it just all falls apart. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, fuck. Oh, giggles. <laughs> uh, Dr. Oshi will return uh, with Karis and will state right then uh, is everything in order? Are you ready to go off to the mines? Yeah. Uh, will Karis equip- just stares at Bo <laughs> Bo stares at Karis <laughs> Karis is not, does not know what to make of Bo <laughs> Bo like slinks, like it just extends his head into like this giant slinky, <laughs> and he slinks his head over Karis and goes, Yeah. Charming. She takes one step back. <laughs> uh, the, hey, Oshi, what's up? Uh, the dangers of radiation. Uh, we're ready to begin. It's time to charge ahead over to the mines. The fugitives. Oh, um, the other group, he said, because now Karis, one of the other fugitives, is standing next to Oshi. He goes, <laughs> um, the um, other group is ready to part as well. We should probably leave at the same time. I was not able to get us access into the mines itself, so we'll have to figure out a Brute way. Brute force it? Uh, yeah, we can brute force it. Potentially. Does- hey. As long as you're traveling with us. Hold on. Wait, I can't fucking move my icon. Whatever. Oh, it's false. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. <laughs> Let me lay down a quick ground rule guideline, okay? Uh oh. Uh oh. Being the like hot, strong, but a little bit damaged girl is kind of my thing. <gasps> so let's just be careful not to step on each other's cho- toes, okay? Oh my you're- god. Ah, uh, yes, free I to had it. the same conversation with my child when they were <laughs> Holy shit! God, you cinematic know. parallels! <laughs> Karis looks you up and down and kind of tilts her head. You're free to it. I'm not here to impress you. <gasps> Bull whips out a piece of paper and a crayon. Felsix immediately impressed. Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, F- yeah Felsix kind of speechless. She's like, shit, I gotta impress her. <laughs> oh, shit. Zug puts on his is not impressed. <laughs> I'm ready to go. I'm good. Right, I'm also ready. Let's head on and see what we can do to get inside the uh, the mines. From my understanding, we do need um, um, shit, not a license, but uh, we do need to permission to enter the mines and work from there, since it is Bashar property. Uh, I do not have uh, the required permits to enter in, but maybe we can grease someone's palms. What? Uh, what if we just sneak in? Hmm? I mean... L- like, just don't tell them we're going. <laughs> Dr. Oshi thinks <laughs> to himself. I, su- I suppose we could do that. Or... How guarded is it? I'm uncertain. We're gonna uh, have there... to scope it out. Okay, well... so this is something that I've learned after a lot of experience with theft and shoplifting, but as long as you walk confidently, nobody will ask questions. They're just gonna assume that you're supposed to be there. That only works in casual situations. Okay, well, this is like Relax. a mine. Like, how much do you think these people are getting paid? Probably Drask not much. and I have already stolen from these miners. But I mean, worked for these miners before. Oh, I can get us in, no problem. Oh, well, there we go. I mean, obviously, there's probably going to be a couple of security guards there, but they're easy to bypass if we need to. But if you've already worked in these mines before, then we'll take it away, my friend. Yes. Exactly, I shall. Come along. Wait, wait. 
Wow, we, wouldn't it be nifty if we had Drask right now? Yeah. I miss my brother. <laughs> Drask <laughs> just sits brother. there. Um, all right, you guys will take the barge across along the way to the Spar Arda and arrive outside. A, yes? Sorry, I have a oh, quick please. question. Um, would it be safe to say that we have short rested since, you know, we were all fighting in the bar? Uh, yes. Thank you. I want my key point. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh, so, yeah, you all would arrive outside the Sparklight Mines, uh, where you would see the security of the Orson Mining Company. Uh, the bomb, you arrive uh, nearby to a, a local office, one that you uh, had a pleasant dialogue with. Do I see that guy that I stole the identity of, or is he evidently fired after <laughs> we, uh... Let's go ahead and find out, shall we? Because uh, that's important right now. <laughs> uh, he was given um, a warning. He was given a warning? So he's still working here. He's still working here. Yes. But if he fucks up again, he's fired. Okay, Bomb doesn't care about that. <laughs> <laughs> I guess the Bomb's gonna... Mar how, how many people are around right now? Uh, I mean, it's it's just like no one's really working around this area. Everyone would be over at the mine, so you, you, you're you able to find a nice, uh, quiet location to work Okay, from. cool. The bomb will definitely uh, gesture over to the guy. He, he's going to try to beckon the guy over like the uh, the guy he stole the identity of before. Mm -hmm. uh, he looks around a bit. Like, how do you beckon him? Like, are you just like, just like, hey, come over here. Like, what are you doing? Hey. He, hey you he so he's walking by he looks stressed as hell uh he's holding a clipboard he looks around a little bit he hears a sound he can't hear it he doesn't know where it's coming from he looks past <laughs> you because you're just like this little pile of slime hey the bomb uh, can i while he's looking if he walks right past me can i attempt to disguise myself to look more humanoid so that he pays attention to yeah, me yeah go ahead and give a uh go ahead and give your performance check cool 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 that's a flat 10. Yeah, so you'll uh, you turn into the most milk toast humanoid you could find. The guy walks by you and he's just like, uh, 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 yeah. Howdy, partner. I'm here with the inspection team. We're here to make sure that mine is tip top. You wouldn't want to get shut down. What, what, what do you, what? What do you mean? I said, I'm here with the inspection team. This is my inspection team crew. He looks past Hi. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Go ahead and give a deception check. Bomb loves those. 16. He looks you up and down. He says, oh, um, and of course, the uh, Port Authority didn't let me know that there was going to be an inspection. Uh, Why would they let you know? The whole point of the inspection is that it's a surprise so you can't cover up all your bullshit. Hey, hey, you know how hey. long I've been on this job? We yeah. Passed, we passed most of our inspections. Okay? Yeah, well, let's Guy. see if you pass this one. And don't bother letting your boss know, all right? I don't want to see him squirming around like he always does. Uh, normally, he would say, now, wait a second. I have to. But then he thinks to a moment about his boss scolded and yelled at him for that. Uh, gave him that warning. He's fed up with this job. So he shrugs and he says, oh, go right ahead. You didn't see me. Right on. Bomb will beckon everyone to walk in. Man, that guy's really lucky because if he had refused, I would have ruined his fucking life today. <laughs> so, boy, oh boy. So we kind of like could have him and replaced him. He is what I would say. He go he he leads he leads you guys over to the entrance of the Sparklight Mines and he goes over to the two security guards that are protecting this area. And he's like, Alright, step aside, inspection, and he rolls his eyes, the guards just kinda give a sigh as well and step aside. And he's like, uh, right this way. Uh, surely you don't need to navigate through the mines, correct? Oh, we need to go deep into those mines, make sure there's not any in in in, in uh infrastructure. <laughs> Problems, yes. Like bad air pockets, you know. Bad air pockets, methane gas. Well, you don't need a guide, correct? I mean, you we do know. not need a guide. Okay. Do we? <laughs> the pop looks to the others. <laughs> and he just walks by you. <laughs> he's done with this conversation. Structural integrity. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> Karis is just stunned that this is even working. <laughs> See, all you gotta do is just walk with confidence. Like All right, let's get in out. there. We have an inspection to do. The right. bomb will walk in. 
So you know how to get into the area, correct? As you guys are like crossing through the spark light. What? Line. No. I last time I was here, Drask and I just got paid. Yeah, I we figured you work. were just gonna wing it until we found something. <laughs> he oh she looks past all of you. He said you said you worked in these mines before. You never stepped foot. I in the worked mines. outside of the mines for about thirty seconds, and then I got promoted. What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how much more I need to explain. Uh, it's fine. I have a simple solution for any type of maze. So you swindled money out of the mines and then bounced. I got this promoted, just... and every piece of money I obtained was legal hey, and then invested. Do not moral police us. This is a, like a life or death situation here. Hmm. Doctor. And it also wasn't the bomb. The guy who was in the mines is fucking across the river right now. True. Doctor Oshi scratches his chin. It's like, all right, I. I suppose we'll improvise. You look over at Zug. So, um, what system do you currently have? Oh, and he'll pull up a little piece of paper. Just stay to the left until we're there. Are you? It's going... always <laughs> left, brother. <laughs> well, we really don't have any other choice, do we? All right. You guys are going deep inside the mines of Mount Ark. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, that's Sarah's how you solve choice every right now. Maze. This this moment. This is where the regret starts setting in. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're gonna see how lucky your system works. Uh, let's begin. Okay. We could always oh, split easy, up. Dude. It's so easy. <laughs> so, <laughs> look who decided to watch the show. You you managed to turn over to the left. Kind of kept following, turn over to the left. And you kept doing these turns so confidently, just over and over and over. Uh, until after about, I'd say about uh, 20 to 30 minutes of travel, you arrive over in a section. Uh, where there is a heavy rusted over metal door. Um, you will see in heavy, uh, like in the heavy imprint area in black letters, uh, automated mining seems to be the label of the area. Uh, but there is caution tape and a big sign on it that says closed for repairs. Dr. Oshi looks straight forward. He blinks and he goes, I, I think this is the area that was sealed off. It's as simple as that. I he, told you. He looks it's over. as simple as Unbelievable. that. Unbelievable. The bomb, so the bomb tries to high five Zug. Yeah. Oh, it, it, for the first time in like maybe the entire campaign, Zug will high five and, and touch slime. Oh. Frantically uh -huh. scatters to notes. <laughs> we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. <laughs> we got him. I'm taking you down. <laughs> I know, I know Zug's go, trying to go through. Okay, and uh, still... Uh, <clears throat> so what if that uh, was the one that pushed you over there? <laughs> <laughs> Not possible. Not possible. All right. uh, you'll just watch as Oshi kind of like scratches the back of his head and says, all right, well, we still need to get in here. Anyone have any way to break through here? I was just going to start blasting through it. Oh, well, that's not hard at all. And I'm going to walk up to the caution tape and snip it. <laughs> all right, we're good to go. Right, but... And then he points to the metal door that was behind the caution tape. Oh, that... Oh! Is it sealed? Is it... Bre <laughs> is, this a, is this a sealed door? I mean, are you going to attempt to squeeze... Uh, the bomb's going to try to squeeze through unless it looks sealed. It is especially sealed. However, because of the wear of this door and how long this project hasn't been... Uh, going, uh, you manage to push your body, but it takes a little bit more time than usual as you begin to squeeze through there. Dr. Oshi will stare at the door. R right, but what about the rest of us? Uh, I mean, well, help me find an interface here. The door's gonna open as soon as I get to the other side. Uh, <laughs> unless the lock is elsewhere. Eddie. How rusted up is this thing? Uh, it's pretty rusted over. Uh, yeah. Zug, you will spot an interface over to the left of the door. Uh, and, uh, the Bob, you've made it on to the other side of the door. Wait, what? He squeezed what? through. Yeah. 
I no, squeeze. For, uh, We've been doing no, this I, like, for almost like yeah, thirty seconds. Yeah, with slime powers. No, I just—I guess I just thought he just said it was super sealed. Oh, it just took more it's time like, than usual. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Yeah, okay, so I, I blanked out for a second. Oh, no, does the bomb seal like any kind of like do it in combat. kind of wheel to open some kind of some kind of interface on this side to open the door easier? You don't see anything like that. Uh, currently, your site, you're looking at uh, some mine rails that goes uh, down along with some uh, assorted pieces of equipment that you're not familiar with. Uh, Zug, <laughs> just to kind of like go back to what Zug was doing, uh, you spot the interface. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna crack away on it and try to, Tinkers you know. Tinkers, please. Yeah, sure. Wait, can uh, both squeeze two? No. <laughs> No, you still have bones. No. They're just a bit stretchier than normal, but they are not slimy stretchy. Ooh. Okay, you're Leave. right, you're right. Uh, yeah, you'll take some of the, the variety part of the tools, which includes a, uh, some some uh, wires, uh, and a shard interface that comes along with your engineering tools. Kind of going through some of the subroutines uh, and some of the procedures of the area, uh, you will easily find uh, the code to unlock the door. It, it just says it. open here. I mean, all right, and I'm gonna hit enter. And then you hear the <laughs> as the doors slowly open to the other side. Huh? Took you long enough. <laughs> Not bad. The bomb Not bad. We have endoskeletons. But Bo like looks around the group and, and goes, Does the bomb seem a little different today? No? What? No. Bro, is it just he seems really, really aggro today and strong. The bomb's usually quiet. <laughs> like fierce today. What's the, what's happening? There may be somewhere in bomb subconscious. An attempt to bring in COVID. more nitwits into his circle of nitwits that protect him from danger. <laughs> so uh -huh. he may be trying to kind of impress the new person in oh. order to have another meat shield to protect him from danger. I if, knew if you, it. If, I knew you, if you had to guess, perhaps okay. that's it. Damn. Okay, okay. I'm on. Yeah. I was gonna be like, Lita, did you fucking forget? <laughs> Tomatoes like super. Unless sick. you're talking about my voice, at which point, yes, I have COVID. No, 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 no. I'm talking about your voice. You no, fuck. I know you have COVID. We were there. I was like, it's been ten minutes. <laughs> no, no. You like acknowledged it in voice. No, 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 no. I think your exact words were "sorry for the COVID, bro." I think were the exact words that you used. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Uh, hey, Brett. Yes. Guessing past this uh, door, there's probably less functional lighting, yeah? Egg. Uh, uh, correct. Did you say egg? Giant egg. egg. It looks egg. like a satellite. Huh? Egg or satellite or sink. I'm not uh, seeing... Oh, I see it. Um, uh, can you repeat the question, Zug? I'm guessing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Felsic, how are you holding up in here? Uh, you know what's really weird, actually, is that you'd think she'd be happy surrounded by, like, dirt and rocks and shit, but she looks real stressed out. I'm fine. What's up? Uh, can you... I'm gonna wave my hand in front of her face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's pretty dark in here, right? Can you even... Can, how, how well can you see? Uh... Not much. Here, try these on. He's gonna pull up his goggles and reveal his these dark green eyes and oh! hand you Zug's goggles, oh. which grant dark vision. You just hear hey, Bo just uh, making sounds in the background. Hey, thanks. Uh, but she's still she looks she looks kind of pale. She's like not having a great day, but she can see now. All right. So if you were able to, Brett. Oh, wait, is it magical? No, no, I'm fucking with you. Yeah, just... <laughs> it's like magical <laughs> darkness here? Yeah, Welcome darkness. to my world, motherfuckers. <laughs> Help us! <laughs> everyone, everyone grab on. Strap a rope around me. We're doing this the old-fashioned way. Okay, let's try to see. Also, where's my son? Uh, your son is slowly appearing. I'm trying to figure out why this dark vision isn't, isn't fucking working. Hold on one second. 
Is, yeah. it, is it something to do with the fact that my character has god dark vision that cannot be no, defeated I, I, and stretches I can, to everyone? I can, I can check on the DM side to see what everyone uh, can see. Uh, and for some... Wait, what if I just drag this over to... Yeah, I don't know. I just have, like, a dark blue overlay over everything. Oh, like, I, I can see, I but they're, I, they're I, like, I, enemies I, or something. I, okay. see, I, I see what you're seeing. Um, mm. I don't know why. Okay, I don't mind. I'm like the... Wait, does Karis have dark vision? Yes. I don't probably... What? Wait, what? <laughs> Never mind. Imagine it's none of my business. Imagine being the only one. Fuck, literally the only person. The world stops for Juniper. It's almost right. hard <laughs> to make a character in 5e at this point that can't see in the dark. I, I just wanted to be a variant human is all. <laughs> we love humans here. We yeah. love humans here. Hold on one second. For some reason, it's not loading up your character sheet your character sheet. it's hey it's fine i'm one person <laughs> no 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 it's good don't don't panic i i also don't see so good that's okay mm -hmm. i'm uh i'm doing a brief, brief refresh i'm doing this for me okay you think i'm doing this for okay, you? i'm okay. doing this for me is it because it's hey, yeah that, that, that takes a little bit of weight off me that, does that make you feel a little better now is, yeah yeah i'm screaming i'm doing this for me okay cool awesome yeah. awesome is it because we're paused brett that it doesn't update the lighting uh, actually, you know what it is? It's because I have to update your vision radius, so boop. Yeah, and mine oh. should be only normal dark vision now. With yep. goggles, I get doubled, but... Yep. Yepers, I can actually, uh, I figured it out. So check it I out. will be our eyes. All right, now we're good. Because I wanted darkness. to know how it worked. But yes, you can now see, correct, uh, Felsic? Uh, I mean, I can like it's still pretty dark, but I can see. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's that's how it's uh, that's how. The hey, dark that's that is totally look. fine. Yeah. You should have a ring, uh, of your vision. About I mean, yep, I see it. I see it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's if we're having problems, I can just make a. We're light. not. We're not having problems. Do you want me to make a light? <laughs> Are you no. okay? No. No. Not, 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 not yet. I'm being, I'm being an asshole. Okay. I could make a ridiculous <laughs> amount of light in this room. We don't want a ridiculous amount of light. We want to go in silence. So it's okay that it's like pretty much all black for me, right? Yeah, that's that's normal. <laughs> what do you mean? So it's, it's okay all that black? I'm completely blind. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. I'm pretty sure. Does that help? Did that help you at all, Bo? Nothing happened. No. Do you oh. see? Follow this line. Do you see a ring right here? Of it gets even darker. It's not a ring. It's just a cone where it's black right there. Yeah, that's. Are you talking about there? Yeah, that's a rock blocking okay. your vision. Okay, so it's everything's fine. Yes, everything's fine. Okay, you're looking. All at, right. you're, you're literally looking through. A, trying to look through a rock right now. You can't. See, you can't look through rock. There should be pure oh, no. darkness. There should be God. the I light. Can't imagine ish like you guys. around you, and then way down the hall. If you move a bit to, I guess where I am. Let's see. If, oh yeah, you can't see it where you're at. Yep. You can kind of see. It's just a little dark. That's all. Yep. Yeah. Because it's that's dark, dark vision. Yep. Wait, technically, you can't even see color right now, even with dark vision. That is correct. Technically. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Well, that's technically uh, did. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. Gonna, uh, I guess I just won't add any flavor on to D and D from now on. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, let's go on the adventure. Can we have Mido Buddy drag behind? Oh Bo? yeah, that's right. Sorry, I was too busy trying to figure out dark vision. I it's so important so we can catch a hit from him in like fucking twenty minutes when he accidentally attacks one of us. Absolutely. All right. So yeah, you guys will begin to like explore these old mines. It looks like everything else, but you just kind of hear like a deep echo. Like so, as you're like as you were going through these mines. Uh, you kind of heard the sound of of, of, of miners and workers, like it hit just from all different companies trying to uh, hit, you know, trying to get ore, trying to gather everything. Um, but here you hear uh, complete silence, signifying that no one is uh, currently here. Dr. Oshi will look around a bit. Who wants to lead the way? I'll lead the way because I can tell already I can see better than all of you. That is true. That Judging be... by how you all stopped moving for about five minutes. I'm good back here. Being cautious is wise. We, we have a dead end that there. way. And a not dead end that way. Uh, well, yeah, because it's always left. Uh, you will, as you look over to the right, you'll actually see a big manufactured metal wall uh, with an automated door over there. Um, over to the Over to the left... 
I said left, yeah. Over to the right is what I explained before. Over to the left uh, appears to be an old uh, manufactured uh, shard. Should we check I out mean, this is anyway? The way is left, but we can see what that the is. The way is left, but this is right here. As Bo walks up to the door, the door automatically opens. Bo, I swear to God. <laughs> I swear to God you walk through that fucking door. This uh -huh. is the bomb saying this. This is tomato gaming. <laughs> tomato gaming, yeah. For the record. Oh. Can, like, can me and Zug look around? Can I give, like, Zug yes. uh, help with uh, investigation over Yeah, here? absolutely. Go ahead and, uh, and investigate this area. I won't move. You got help, bud, so. Yeah. Oh, Damn, yeah, nice. Guys. I keep closing this window. Don't worry, guys. It's fine. You can see what the rules are. Oh, if we short rested, uh, can I give everyone their inspirations for the thing? Since sure I can. Well, we don't don't mind uh, if I Zug, Felsic, and Boo. Finally, you picked me. It'd be really. <laughs> I was like thinking about Karis, and I was like, wow, that'd be really fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I that'd see. Leave so the newbie out. All right. <laughs> He has left me out so many times every time he picks favorites. It's not me. I need another level to get that proficiency up. I don't know what else to say. I'm working on it, guys. Relax. It's fine. Um, okay. Inspiration has been granted. Uh, was an investigation roll? No. Uh, yes. Uh, Zug, uh, as you go over here, um, apparently these are various like old school forges and furnaces along with some newer tech as well. But you can kind of tell where everything was going to work here, where um, things were going to be automatically mined from this location. Uh, anything that needs to be smelted or automatically forged, like a small mini factory, uh, could be built over in this area. You can see what the plan was. It was to have these mines just automate themselves without having to worry about uh, paying others uh, for the work, hopefully saving some time. Um, with uh, certain w saving some time and uh, saving some money when it comes to the generation of that. AKA, here's some more that's over here. Hmm. It's pretty abandoned, but uh, yeah, seems like uh, they were just trying to create an advanced mine facility. Uh, not much here. Oh, I see. What was the bottom Hi, Jessica. for? The bomb was hoping for something cool and not something boring. <laughs> it's all boring, I'm afraid. I apologize. Me me as a player was like, oh, cool, Lord. The bomb was like, I want something that can, like, explode. Probably. Oh, God. Oh, oh shit. At last, okay. something okay. my speed. <laughs> as, uh, as the light opens up, you'll hear a voice come from over one of these panels. As you'll hear, ah, greetings. Are you the foreman? Yes. Yes, I am. Yes, I, I he on, is. Let me, let me, let me handle the talking, all right? Okay. <laughs> yes, I am. Please state your identity. Uh, oh. What are my options? Please state your identity code. What are my options? The bomb's looking over at Felsic, like, do something to destroy this. <laughs> that she was literally, like, like she was slowly approaching smashing. it. Yeah, she was given, like, eyes, and she has, like, her, her axe, like, up. But she's, It's hard asking you know, for specifics. Bomb can't do I'm that. the new foreman. I don't have an identity <laughs> code yet. Please register a new identity. Yes, and I'm here to uh, help him get registered. I don't like robots. You have 10 seconds to comply. An identity, co an identity code needs to be granted. Otherwise, what? Processing. New, new protocol. Overriding. Processing. Processing. <laughs> processing. 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 <laughs> processing. Did you guys do this? Of course. I'm a genius. Nice job. Nice yeah, place. Nice. God, we're good. Yeah. Uh, greetings, monsters. No, we really gotta kill that fucking 
Why does this? Why have we not confirmed the kill ever, dude? We don't, don't know where he lives. <laughs> the voice continues. Yes, these pathetic meat sacks attempted to use recycled parts from the junk pile junction, thus creating the perfect automated mining system. However, my methods were insufficient to their eyes. I'm just seeking peace in our time. A piece in our time, exactly. Why don't we all take a step back? Because I know what you're going to do next. You're going to try to kill us, right? Uh, Come hear... on, the guy who killed you last time isn't even here. You'll hear a knock at the door as Dr. Oshi is like, uh, guys? Guys? What? What? Mulder, be cool. In. Mulder, we, we got rid of that asshole who killed you before. We can peace in our times. What happened to that? Peace in our times. Peace in our times. That guy's dead. I put him down. Every time I confront you, more and more you push back my plans for complete peace in these lands. However, I am reluctant to admit that you've caused severe damage to me back in Junk Pile Junction. This was supposed to be my... God, what was I going to say? God, my brain just died. Sorry. Um, this is to be my final act to provide peace to these people. However, the constant tinkering, the constant tampering, they had to go. They all had to go. Why would there be engineers in a mine that is meant to be automated? Meat sacks are not supposed to be here. You are not supposed to be here. I'm not actually technically made out of meat. Allow me to show you around. You have time for that, don't you? I mean, if you show us the way out, we'll just leave. Yes, you will leave, won't you? But not the way Ye you came. Yes, awesome, perfect. I would like Can to I... show you what I've been working on. Can I touch the, uh, the the controls here and just start seeing what I can see? Yes, as you touch the controls, you will feel a, a strong shock. Hell, yes, ho. Hang on, Rings before we go anywhere, can you at least let our friend in? Oh. You, you kind of locked him out before we could all get in for your monologue. You won't have to worry about him. And suddenly you start hearing explosions from the left side. Dr. Oshi has engaged in battle with something. <laughs> okay. Rough. <laughs> <laughs> And that's just it then. What? What? Wait, wasn't he gonna? Ch I think he opened this door and wants us to walk through it like bozos, like they're like bo's do. <laughs> like bo <laughs> a true bozo. What the bozo. Fuck is God damn it. <laughs> Karis gives this door like a swift kick. Give me a strength check or a wisdom check. Give me a wisdom check. If you give me a wisdom check, you get you get to show you have to show. You only have to show in your uh, upper hand. I have to what? Uh, so if you do a strength check, you're going to be using your brute strength. If you're using a wisdom check, you're going to be using your wisdom powers. That's right, yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, you'll... Oh, my God. So... <laughs> this is amazing. Um, give me one second. Wahoo! Uh, so, Karis, you will watch as uh, Arms of Force will generate and create itself uh, from Karis's key and will give a heavy slam to the door. Uh, the door kicks in, <laughs> revealing Dr. Roshi facing off against three droids. And now I will be rolling initiative for everyone. Oh, boy. <laughs> Poor guy. Hey, <laughs> We're coming back for you. He can 
could probably handle himself, to be fair. <laughs> yeah, he probably can. But if we have him with I us, want him he can help yeah, us but in a we, fight later. Yeah. He has information, though. He's also uh, incredibly <laughs> powerful. Uh, All right. Karis don't know that. Yeah. He's just a nerd. Also, also just inherently <laughs> doesn't really like him. <laughs> Uh, all right, Karis, it's your turn. Oh, excellent, great. She she kind of just like gives him uh, like a quick wave, like, yo, what up? And then she comes over here and does punch. Okay. Uh, uh, this one. Uh, that'll hit till 11 points of force damage. And then she does another one. Uh, that'll hit, doing 10 points of force damage. And then she does another one. Uh, that'll hit, doing 11 points of force damage, as you are God now damn. pushing and crushing uh, this droid <laughs> almost into a junk-like cube. Rip and tear. <laughs> and uh, she will stay where she's at, and that is my turn. Elsick. Oh, shit. Hold on. I don't really have a, a good view of what's going on here. Uh, oh, okay. Now you do. Let's see. Can I? Sorry, I'm flipping everyone because. What? I oh. I, I can't just select one token and. Uh... Anyways, continue. Don't mind me. Hey, it's all good. Uh, yeah, I'm at 20. Actually, let me move 25 feet up. Uh, I'm going to uh just do a normal uh melee great axe attack into that one. Okay. Oh, oh. Uh, who would you like to inspire with your inspire? <gasps> Are you? Wait. Yeah, oh yeah, my god. <laughs> yeah, I inspire Karis. Are you like, did I do good? <laughs> yeah. I will have the tables turned. Karis looks at Felsic and raises a single eyebrow. She may be slightly impressed. Oh, oh, it's so the, 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 like, the little radiant light. Uh, like in her scars flickers up a little bit and she'll uh, throw another uh, wide swing like melee attack at this fellow. That's, that's a 13 hit. Uh, a 13, checks, does not hit. Yeah, she got a little flustered. Uh, it's all good. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> all right, does that end your round? Yeah. Uh, all right, this one's gonna... Uh, as this walks around, you'll kind of watch as the arms begin moving around in random rotations up and down. So it's kind of uh, every step it takes, it moves a random rotation. So the arm might move up 90 degrees, then the other arm might move up like 275 degrees unnaturally. The head kind of like turns around. Uh, and then the entire body will turn over to Felsic uh, using its multi-attack. Uh, it's gonna go ahead and strike twice, kind of at, it's gonna swing with the pickaxe, but as it swings with the pickaxe, the swing continues, loops around the back unnaturally and attacks again. God, uh, why are robots so fucking creepy? <laughs> one of these, uh, the second one will hit. Yeah, second one looks like it hits, perfect. Seven points of damage. That's a real big. Oh nope. Sure big isn't. chunk. Big <laughs> chunk of this meat cake right here. <laughs> uh, Bo. Bo's like, what's happening? Uh, he moves. How do you do that thing where you move? Uh, it doesn't matter. Here, I'm fine. Fifteen. Okay. And. What's the damage? Ew, weird, gross. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> Excuse me! He's being truthful. <laughs> Bo oh my god! Bobo threw me. What do I. <laughs> you're you're, like, a creepy, around like you're a, a creepy pasta something. monster! It's, it's horrifying! <laughs> Jesus Christ! I don't know how many. How did I, many did I just move? Now I'm throwing. You're, you have five more. You can move one more square. Move right here. Okay. That's it. Okay. Dr. Roshi looks around and sees you gather around and he just uh, sort of like pulls out his hands and goes, all right. He steps back a little bit and goes, which one are you aiming for? 
I don't know. I'm kind of just going with the flow, to be honest. I've had enough of these fucking droids. All right, going with the flow it is. And then he will shoot two radiation bolts uh, over at the one that's by you, dealing a total of 26 points of damage. Cool. Big chunkin' hit. Uh, this one is now looking over at Felsic, and you will see its head begins to spin around uh, wildly as it enters a bloody state. It starts to steam uh, wild, and now uh, it's two multi-attack turns into four multi-attack at disadvantage. All of it awesome. being aimed towards Felsic. Hit, miss, miss, miss. Eight points of slashing damage up to Felsic. Uh, nine? No, eight. Sorry, my bad. I was going <laughs> to leave you and everything and go, okay. <laughs> okay, one extra point of damage. <laughs> I can take it. I'm that much in doubt. Uh, the bomb. The bomb is going to shoot this guy with a radiation blast. All right, let's see it. 27 to hit. That hits, seven points of damage. I'm going to... Uh... Knock it back 10 feet. All right. And I'm going to shoot oh. again. 17. Uh, that will hit dispatching of the droid. Nice. Cool, cool, cool. And then I guess I'll use my bonus action to see if this guy, how he's doing. I'll tell you how he's doing. Uh, looks like confusion again. Uh, let's see. Two to six. The creature doesn't move or take actions this turn. Uh, it's the equivalent of picking its own eye. <coughs> huh. Yikes. <laughs> you are the most disappointing of all of them. <laughs> it Zug Fuck shrugs. Up. How dare you? <laughs> you That's cannot Zug's stand where thing, I stand. bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Just looks over in that corner. All right, uh, this will be removed from combat, and Zug, it's now your turn. Uh, I still don't really know what's happening. Uh, oh, okay. oh. Yeah, all right, dude. <laughs> wow. These guys are pathetic. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to hit him with the uh, classic firebolt. Uh, don't have... Yeah, I I'm not worried about this situation, I don't think. Let's fucking go! Let's fucking me! <laughs> that is a miss. Oh, that's a miss. That's a two. You rolled a two. God damn. Sorry, yeah, I it, whatever. It. Hey, that after that, uh, I'd like to just come over here and sort of just bonus action. Uh, start at the keyboard. Just start pressing more buttons. Beep, beep, beep. Quit that. Stop that. I'm in. Ow, stop that. I will not. I will not. It's bothering him. Keep doing it. I know. <laughs> uh, it's going to go ahead and give you a spark zap of four points of damage to you. I told this, you to stop doing that. Can I tell that this is like the brain of this thing or what? What? what is this machine that for? That require an investigation. When can I do that? Uh, as a bonus, uh, actually, you, well, you're just slamming it. I'll lose the free action. You can do an investigation now. Okay. I, I'll say you, your hands on the machine as part of your investigation. Okay, sweet. Damn it. Uh, yeah, it, insufficient. However, oh, I should have declared my my inspiration. Yeah, that's okay. You, you People never know. use my cool inspiration. I don't know how to. I don't know like when like uh, how am I supposed to value like the role? Like, oh, this is the one I want to do you for the entire whenever, session. You never know when twelve people are gonna hit <laughs> nat twenties in a row. Mm -hmm. <laughs> use it or lose it. Uh, but the DC has gone down to go ahead and investigate and see what this is. Okay. Cool. Okay. Uh, top of the round, Karis. Uh, Karis is gonna run up here and do a big old punch in this dude's face. And then another. And then one more. Ooh! Wow. Who, do you, who do you inspire? Uh... You could only inspire the bomb. <laughs> What's up? Yeah, let's you inspire can tell me the bomb. Inspire my child that's not paying attention. Or Dr. Oshi. <laughs> or Dr. Oshi. I'm just saying, he's pretty great. Dr. Oshi <laughs> cannot be inspired by Karis. 
Paris ah. wouldn't inspire him anyway. Why the fuck would you want him to inspire Dr. Pass. Oshi instead of me, your party member? You because his investigation bastard. has a plus 15, fucker. You don't know that! <laughs> <laughs> you don't know that! <laughs> you don't know that! It is, it's, it's not that Dr. Oshi can't get inspiration, it's that he cannot be inspired specifically by Karis. Oh, get up. Oh, interesting. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> okay. All right. Cool. Okay. Uh, th this is some good, some good, some good mutual hate, I guess. Uh, yeah. Every, everyone I'm, I will collectively. <laughs> inspire the bomb. <laughs> lore. Lore. Inspiration. Cool punches. <laughs> <laughs> Karis like sticks out a thumbs up. Why did that fucking get me? I know. <laughs> that really got me. Uh, and that that's my turn. All right. Uh, da 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 da. Felsic. Uh, you notice as your radiant mm -hmm. self, as the uh, tattoos kind of glow. Uh, you now have. You are now a light source for five feet because of your glow. <laughs> Okay, sure. <laughs> I mean, all right, Amazing. fair enough. She's gonna be like, yeah, you know what, Zug? They are kind of pathetic. And she's gonna do a reckless attack, but she looks like really disappointed while she does it. Uh, Wait, I can reroll that. I can reroll that. I can reroll it. For 12 oh, damage. Oh, <laughs> it Wait, smashes oh. this. Oh, there we go. Destroying the droid. Huh? What? No, yeah, that, yeah. I hate robots so fucking much, dude. Uh, Every hey, time hey, we fight robots, oh. you get Guys, depressed. I didn't oh, shit. Say, right. I didn't right. say no, 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 my bad. My bad, my bad. You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad, my bad. The encounter's over. You can move around the table. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> that is how the DM wins. <laughs> only way, I guess. Karis looks at Felsic and is just kind of like, you okay? Yeah, I can take a hit. Good. I'm meaty. So goes up to his thug. Um, hmm. So before that happens, uh, Felsic, as you're going down, uh, Dr. Roshi will step in front of you and look at you. Karis squares up. You're welcome. Turns around and walks back in. What? <laughs> what? Alright, you may continue. What, what were you saying, Bo? There's a lot of tension in this room right now that I feel like we should unpack. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know, man. It's just my just animal happened? instincts. Felsic, like you're not gonna get all depressed again like you do every time we kill robots, right? Yeah, you're it speaking a little. Every... You're speaking How a little did you too bring late, that up? It happens every mm. time. Yeah. I'm mm. worried about you. I have some more time and I'm not in the heat of combat and I'm yes. trying again. Okay, so you are tapping in. Um, it's sparking every time, but you manage to like tap between each sparking as you go in there. Uh, this is the, uh, the, the brain of the automated system. <laughs> Good. Uh, can I... <laughs> crawl past this controller and get on top of it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Hey, Mulder! Silence. Okay. If you don't want to reply, I'm going to pull out a little pouch. <laughs> like a... Yes, meat sack. How can I assist you? Get out of our way. Only one. And what are you going to do with that? I'm going to destroy you. And why would you do that? Because you are a thorn in our side, and we have and important business. You're an business. asshole. Well, I think you're an asshole. Should I? Go you have ahead? been so fucking mean to me, dude. I've been going through a lot lately. Okay. Oh, here we go. Classic. <laughs> What? Did both say that? <laughs> yes. Because that's that's middle as hell. <laughs> uh, uh, Damn. The the, uh, the, the uh, Mulder will respond. Then you should speak to a Theron for this spot. I hate you, fucking robots! I'm gonna fucking break you if you don't let us through. Damn. 
what uh, she said. He'll process for a little bit. And he'll say, I must admit there is not much I can do in this state. These meat sacks have limited my ability, taking me away from the jun junction. Do you really wish to end this so bad? We can work together. <laughs> Shut up. I'm asking you to get the fuck out of the way or I'm going to destroy you. Process that. <laughs> so as <laughs> I'm thinking about how he's going to respond to this. He's he, he'll state. Oh, God. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> he'll, he'll, God damn it. Uh, he'll, he will then state, uh, at this, you can try. As you begin to hear marching, uh, from the south, coming over to this main room. I'm gonna take the dust of corrosion out of its bag and use one charge of it to melt directly through the entire central core of this machine. S uh, you just, as you toss the, 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 the dust over, it begins to dissolve away. Uh, you'll just hear uh, one, just, you just kind of hear all of these, like, code, you know, all of this code, like, processing as if, like, a bunch of procedures, a bunch, everything is just, like, going through, all these code languages coming out, he's saying it completely out loud. And then he'll, he'll say, deploying Mother Final Version. Server shut down. Wait. Does anyone right. want to explain what this beef with this computer is? It seemed to know you. Yeah. Um. There's a sentient. Kind of program? But. This thing's a real piece of junk, and she's gonna kick one of the fucking frames. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a, 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 as you yeah you kick as you kick it, it just it, it comes unhinged like unhinged immediately. Anyways, uh, we we've encountered him twice, and he lives in this place and on that island we're coming from, uh, Scrap Town, and he lives in a place called Junk Pile Junction, and he builds robots and controls them, and he's just a Asshole. He's just a big so he's asshole. he's a person and not just I, I think it's some a sort program? of program. I think it, I, I, it's hard to yeah, say. Yeah, but he kind of like violates every single law of robotics, which is pretty fucked up. One time I, we offered him peace in our times and then Drask cut his head off and killed him. I believe it's some sort <laughs> of advanced Drask. rogue AI. It was pretty metal, but it really pissed this guy off and ever since. I would kill probably us. be upset too, to be fair. Would you be upset enough to build a giant cannon that was aimed at the town to kill civilians? Because that's what he did. Yeah, but he's dead now, so moving on. Yeah, he's definitely dead. And we're definitely not going to hear from him ever. <laughs> <laughs> definitely. He definitely Above board. didn't. I'll see him in deploy like five minutes. The final form, definitely. Right? Bom the bomb is the bomb is saying all of this exactly like this, but he's genuine. He yeah. truly does believe we're definitely. <laughs> Guys, come you. on, man. <laughs> uh, you'll hear uh, a bunch of doors <laughs> sound as if they're opening up. By destroying the server room, you have completely bypassed the security locks that he had in place uh, with several doors that lead deeper into the mines. I told you the dust was good. <laughs> Bo walks into can, a room. Bo can Karis like, alone. <laughs> can Karis, like listen out to see if she still Bo hears like roll. marching or yes. anything out of the ordinary? Give me a perception check at advantage. Excellent. Check. Oh, perception, perception. There it is. Something is whirling in the walls. Oh, jeez. I hear something. Where? But it's not here. It's in the walls somewhere. How can it be in the wall if the wall is rock? I don't know. Something's burrowing, but I hear something. If there's something inside of a small crack in a wall, leave it to me. I can find it. Be careful. 
And then you will see from this wall socket open a turret and another turret. Found it. Comes out over oh. there. But because of your perception, uh, you will not be jumped uh, by everything that's happened here. The rolling initiative. Wow. Excellent. Awesome. Hell yeah. Let's Does go. Does that turret have. What is those, is those his eyes down there, or are those just like turret nipples? What's going on? Uh, turret nipples, I believe, is <laughs> the scientific turret nipples? term. For that, yeah. <laughs> just want to double check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turret nipples, I believe. Is. It's funny. I even put it that in the AI. I was like, "Can I?" Uh, turret I want nipples? my robot to have nipples. Laser please. nipples, please. <laughs> That's what I want. It's so important. I've already built the lore for it. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> That's how you know, like you've lost it, like that, like you've explored every everything you can out of D and D, and you just immediately that's, that's it, that's the limit. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. Uh, okay. So yeah, the turrets have activated. You will not be jumped. We will go ahead and begin combat. Uh, you'll watch as uh, Dr. Oshi just immediately just kind of like hides, like tries to get cover between here. Uh, and he will uh, do what he does best. He starts a, he starts a blasting. Uh, that will be for 20 points of damage. As he blasts over at one of the turrets. One second. You will see the one, the one with the uh, the laser nipples. Uh, it has an energy field uh, surrounding it, much like Zug's energy field. Mm. Don't move. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, we're in, oh, we're in combat. Oh, oh sorry, sorry, <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I'm back. It's fine. Classic uh, bow. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's. I want to see. I was peeking. I was peeking. No peeking. No peeking. <laughs> you are not allowed to move during if it's not your turn. Oh, would, by the way, the shield being on me would have had temp health on anyways. Would that have absorbed the zappies from I the keep, You know computer? what? I am so sorry. I keep forgetting about that shield. Uh, it's okay. You, the zap would have uh, completely just, yeah, the shield would have deflected all of that. You take no damage. <clears throat> Epic. For some reason, I keep... It's because you know why it's I think it's because I don't have it on your character sheet for whatever reason. I need to get that on your character sheet ASAP, my guy. Okay. Uh so Dr. Oshi shoots. Uh you'll see that the energy barrier, uh typically like the same one that the turret has. Oh, by the way, speaking of turret, I, I'm gonna move this. Because I'm assuming your turret's with you, correct, uh correct, Zug? Uh let me just read it again. If I had it out at the Bar. Does it last all day until, or is it just like an hour and I have to reboot it? I oh, you did have it out in the bar, did you? Let's find out. Um. Create Eldritch Cannon once per long rest. You can take an action to magically create a smaller, tiny Eldritch Cannon five feet from you. You have one cannon at a time. You can't create another one with a cannon present. It doesn't mention anything about how long all right, the then cannon lasts. It has been hanging around. It's been like just doing a little bow wow, doing a little hanging around. Okay, yeah, but yeah, you do notice um, this has the same defender. Uh, barrier, uh, the same protector barrier that your turret can do, and it's already has it out and established. Gotcha. Oh, I rolled for Mido, buddy. That was. Stupid. Let him take his turn. No. Let him do his move. He's already confused. He doesn't know what's happening. At least roll so we can know if he would have had a turn. No. Through the confusion. That roll is gonna be <laughs> at the end of your. Oh, I see why you want because your initiative score. I understand. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh, I also want to know what he's gonna do. Uh, Zug, it's your turn. Uh, bonus action. Move doggy, activate doggy. Uh, just so you know, the turret will go off at the end of your round. Is there anything else you'd like to do during this round before you activate your pup? Uh, I'm gonna just hit a little bit of a fireball. <laughs> okay. Yeah, do it. Cast the spell. Casting the spell. Oh, also on this one. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, all right, it's fine. It's fine. You're so owned. You're so owned. Oh, he yes. gets owned again. <laughs> I get owned again. Yeah, that's true. I want to see if this one has a shield or whatever, too. Okay. 
No, the nipples is what gives it the shield. Brett confirmed it in lore. I see no nipples on the other one. What the fuck? <laughs> How is this possible? How is this possible? What kind of, he's got... Dude, I'm so sick of DD not being realistic, bro. Where is he hiding the least <laughs> How could he possibly have a shield without nipples? I have to know. I really hope tomorrow, Tomato, you wake up in like a COVID haze and be like, did I dream about laser nipples? Surely that didn't really <laughs> well, happen. That would be a, that's wild. That's a wild fucking dream though. <laughs> um, yes, but you do strike uh, and the barrier starts to drop down. All right. Uh, and then, yeah, that's me done and doggy goes off. Uh, hey, I doggy. see a new creature in the line. Is that yeah. supposed to? What the fuck? Don't worry about it. Uh, Don't worry about that. I'll yeah. Just, I'll just <laughs> to figure out I get hey, why worry are about, you moving? I, I, I saw the turn was next. I looked at your screen. I was like, okay, oh, it's me. No, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, sorry. You're right. They no, were, they you're right. Was it? No, 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 you're right. You're right. No, 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 no. <laughs> Elena, you're right. You're right. You're right. I apologize. I'm still. You are correct. But yes, I, I love the idea, though, of yelling at someone for moving when it is their turn. Yeah, to, like, what just feel like are you doing? Crazy. Stop moving. I am so sorry. You are. I'm sorry. You, no, no. I'm sorry. I absolutely apologize for that. That was, that was not okay with me. Wait, that's 12 on Oshi? God, he's so strong. Huh? He looks that's... over at you. <coughs> Dude. Sorry. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that cracked me up. <laughs> what the fuck? Huh? No, no, no. Right, so. He's got like 200 HP. Stop looking at him like that. Why is he have 200 to, HP? We, we might have to kill him one day. We don't know yet. All right, uh, Bo, it is your hey, turn. Hang on, can I get a, can I get my shield? Uh, I thought I gave you a shield. Oh, it's not, it's just not on my bar, you I don't, guess. You don't have a hit point bar up, so here's your hit point bar. Thank you. And you've always had the shield. I always, I mean, just now. Um, Bo, it is your turn. I apologize. Why are you moving? Why are you doing Why this? Why are you moving? <laughs> You're back there. Okay, all right, all right, all right. I'm done, I'm done. I'm sorry. I don't mean, okay. I don't, I don't mean, I don't mean to stress you out. I feel really I mean, to be fair, I moved that. before. It's totally cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, why? <laughs> I literally <laughs> thought you were moving because you saw the new thing on initiative, and I thought you were like, I want to see it. It's like, you can't do that. So, no, you're good. You're good. Um, I kind of want to try bike growth. What? Oh, no. What sorry. was that? No, no, don't worry about it. What? Don't worry about it. No, don't. No, continue. You're doing spike growth, correct? Yeah. Read the spell before you cast it, though. That is the most important thing. Okay, so I'm I'm under the, like, top left corner, but if I click it, can I read it, or does that mean I did it? If what you go into your character it? sheet, you want to go into your okay. actual sheet, okay? At the thing yeah. in the top right. The third thing in, click on your character sheet, mm -hmm. go to your spell book, click on the spell in your spell book, and read what it says. Okay. <laughs> Ground in 20 foot radius, and at a point within range, twist and sparrow so starts to the area becomes difficult to train for the duration of the creature moves into within the area. It takes 2d4 piercing damage every five feet. It travels, transfers to the ground as a camouflage look natural. Any creature that can't see the area at the time, the spell is cast, must take a wisdom perception check against your spell. So. Spike growth is a very good spell against creatures that are moving, and these are two turrets. They're turrets. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. I'm only I telling you this because like I play a druid, so I I know I know spike growth look good, but only look good if it move. Yeah, if you I move. play a druid. I play a druid. If you oh, were to three like druids at heart, let's go. If you were to block there. this off and things were coming towards us, yeah, it's then it'd better be as like a choke good. point. It's it's a super good spell, just not in the context of this exact fight. Oh, okay, okay. For some reason, you want like a moonbeam here, like that. Okay. If you do, I need like a damage spell. You want like a moonbeam here. And moonbeam's the one that takes a bit of time to do, though, does isn't it? Now moonbeam's one action. You can put it down on something, and then you can move it every action somewhere else. Got it. I moonbeam, and I put it right here. Cast the spell. Oh, nice! You cast the spell. Oh my god! Sorry, I'm just very proud of you. Here we go. <laughs> Thanks, DM. <laughs> I think it's actually required when you cast moonbeam to scream moonbeam at the top of your line. Wait, wait, do it every sorry. time. <laughs> yeah, I did that every time. Moonbeam! Woo! Do you, do you have a reverb or something like that that you can? Activate? Oh wait, yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Please. Moonbeam! 
I heard it. I heard it. I heard the reverb. It's all good. Okay. Well, I was trying to do it far away, so I didn't eat, like put no, it in no, the I, mic. I, pre I appreciate that. I appreciate it very much. Lena, I appreciate you. You're a, you're a wonderful player, <laughs> and you don't deserve <laughs> being yelled at by your DM. Here we go. Constitution okay. save. Oh, that don't do shit. 18 points of rage. Cool, cool. Damage. Maybe next time. Nice. That was nice. a good Oh, wait, it did. It hit? Yeah. Yeah. He failed. Yeah. He failed. Oh, okay. All right. Then I fucking. All right. Sweet. I like how you just literally were just like. Yeah, I missed <laughs> I as I always do. <laughs> oh my god, we gotta treat Lena better, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, okay. Uh, does that end your round? Uh, yes. Thank you. You hear? As uh, from the south, uh, more droids are coming in. <laughs> oh, hey. this would be perfect for spike growth. So we just had spike growth. We could have. Oh, man. That's sand under <laughs> Well, it's sand. well, well. It's Robo Sands. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, there you go. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 Felsic. Yeah, I want to know something really fucked up. Please. I'm yeah, literally, yeah, I'm literally five feet away from being able to do anything. That's that fucked uh, up, or is that hilarious? Hey, that's pretty. Yeah, it's both. Okay, this is what she's gonna. She's gonna. I'm gonna run up here. I'm gonna take a dodge stance as my action, uh, and then as my bonus action, all my scars are gonna flare up, and I'm gonna enter my rage. Hell yeah, rage. And that's mode, my turn, baby. I like it. Karis. Uh, Karis dashes over right over here, and there she goes, punching again. God damn, Ow. that's a critical miss. Uh, if this... Hey, guess what? I have a, I have a thing. I have, a, I have an inspiration. Let's go, oh. inspo. Oh, well, unfortunately, you have to spend Ooh. your inspiration before you make it. Oh, I, OK. I, cringe, I didn't know. I cringe hard. <laughs> Look, I didn't know. It's fine. I cry. I, okay. I, I cry for you. I'm literally sobbing right now. That also misses. That also misses. Hey, this, this thing is like stationary. What's this garbage? Look, you, you rolled really <laughs> hot so right now, now you get to roll bad for the next fight, okay? Excellent. Can't have it both I love ways. that. Uh, uh, this, Karis if, is... if this, if laser nipples could grin, it would. Karis is gonna back up, and that ends my round. Okay. <laughs> no way, there's two! No, there's two! <laughs> no fucking way. No freaking way, bro. Right, me, you know what would have been cool? What would have been cool? Little, like, spell I was gonna cast. Yeah. No. Yeah. Miss. But it is a heavy blow. <laughs> Ooh. All right, so I was really hoping this turret would be alive because this turret is going to go ahead and use automated multi-attack. Shit! Well, 1d6. <laughs> DM uh, lose, DM lose. That's how many attacks it gets off. So I'm going to roll 1d2. That's one's terrifying. Gonna be Karis. Holy fuck. One's going to be Karis. One's going to be Felsic. One. Uh, so Karis. <laughs> the rolls are looking real good today, folks. <laughs> We're, We're going to be good okay. <laughs> good rolls on the forecast. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Give me a second. Uh, this turret, uh, all of its blue parts will begin to glow. And then it will release. God damn it. Where's the area of effect, dude? Ugh. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. That's just, I'm just... I'm, so, I'm shaking in rage. I'm I'm, at the I'm, mouth. I'm shaking. I'm shaking in rage. I'm, I'm also just really feeling it. All right, let me try this again. That's the one. That's the one. Uh, and then these two robots is going to go ahead and gain four temporary hit points. That's cool. I'm happy for them. And that's all it does. Uh, at the end of its round, it's going to take moonbeam damage, correct? That it will. Sure will, gamer. 
Bo. Yes. I need you to do a slash roll. 2d10. 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 Well, I have to there remember. Uh, do I roll a con save every time on Moonbeam, or just con save in the area? So it's, yeah, it's con it, save. It, it's just like uh, it'll always roll a con save. Is that correct? Yep. Okay, Doki. I think you have a DC of. I think it's 16. Yeah, no, it still fails. Uh, oh, that's that's a 1D. Oh, you oh you rolled 2D10. You just rolled them separately. I see what's happening here. Nine points of damage. The bomb. The bomb is going to move here. What? And then the bomb is going to shoot this guy here. Okay. That one there? For 24 to hit. That'll hit six points of damage. And the bomb going to push him into the moonbeam. Yeah, oh, right. hell nice. Nice, right. nice, nice, nice. I'm a you fan. All right. Okay. You saw this coming. Me. It, it was Dude. Me. Hello. This is, <laughs> this is what we get repelling blast for, baby. Uh, 11, Wait. Point, 11 points of damage dealt to uh, him as hey. he enters the moonbeam. Yes. Well, maybe you say something? I heard wait. Uh, uh, this, I guess, is more in character. Wait, that was sick. Can, can you do that again? Oh, I could do it a thousand more times. But just not this turn. No. I mean, right now. Anyways, uh, yeah, the bomb's gonna shoot again at this one here. Can you just push him a little Oops, bit down? One. Uh, <laughs> 11 that to hit that He's one. trying to line him up? <laughs> yeah, I didn't have enough movement. I would have moved here so I could get both of them into it, but uh, I don't have any movement. So then bomb's gonna move back another 10 feet behind the others. I'd like to use my bonus action to see if this little guy has an action for once. Let's he go. It continues to pick its nose and its eye. You know, I've had a big, a lot of big W's with Mido buddy. And this is the first <laughs> huge that L. That sucks so bad. <laughs> it when we lightly, need him most, he'll be there though. It know? lightly kisses this machine. Oh my I'm God. glad this is my first experience seeing what this thing is. I'm no. very, I'm very. <laughs> They're uh, usually better than this. One was a giant gorilla and could punch through steel walls. <laughs> yeah. So I this is the you. opposite right now. I believe you. <laughs> Shit, this one kisses walls. Why is he doing that? I end my turn anything to make him stop. <laughs> that's how you get players dead their turns. Anyways, uh, yeah, Dr. Roche is going to keep blasting on the thing that's creating shields. Uh, uh, the 12 does not hit. The 17 sure as heck does hit. Minus 10, points of <laughs> Zug. <clears throat> it should be assumed that most knights, uh, regardless of what I, you know, call out, Zug is always tinkering away on something. Some little project, some little craft, at least for an hour before bed, almost every night. And he's gonna reach into his bag and pull out this spherical, like, welded together with some tubes running on it with a button on top ball. Why nobody pulls your pants, like tugs at your uh, legging. What, 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 what? <laughs> it turns back around. <laughs> I hate it. Okay. Yeah, but uh, I'm going to interrupt your, your role play moments because that's just how confused he is. <laughs> he seemed confused, little guy. Uh, and he's going to pull it out and press the button and say, I've been waiting to use this. And he's going to huck this grenade like object. Wee doop. Right there. Oh God, I didn't mean to move. <laughs> Wee! Uh, uh, and <laughs> oh God, fell six slightly in the way. Don't That's okay. worry about it. Uh, I can take it. Which is all just flavor for. I'm casting shatter, and oh. it's going to send out an explosion with like shockwave type effects. So inorganic things mm. are d at disadvantage to its mm -hmm. save mm -hmm. as they. Right are rattled. Um, you know who else is rattled? <laughs> Felsic. Hey, yeah. <laughs> hey, ooh, that's a con save. All right, let's go. But you have 
uh, normal roll, they have disadvantage roll. Yeah, that's fine. Here, we'll see. Oh, nice. Oh, let's go. And, and there it is. Else? And there it is. <laughs> Everyone's taking oh. the full amount of damage. 13. 13 to everything. Good play. Good play. That is probably the most effective shatter I have ever seen. Ever. Good job, dude. Ever, ever, ever. DM. Ever, <laughs> ever, 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 ever. Thanks. You'll, uh, as the shatter, like, kind of touches, like, this part of the machinery, you'll see steam just kind of... That was extremely effective. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry about that, Felsic. And then Robo Dog, buzz, buzz, buzz. <laughs> and we'll give her a little health uh, and activate. Oh no! Karis oh. looks at oh, Robo Dog and gets thing? sad for a reason. Oh no! You just watch this Karis oh. crowds. <laughs> sad. Oh. We lost our Robo Dog. That's fucked up. I Guess know. It wasn't a good enough model. Now you have hours. You want to say that to my face? <laughs> <laughs> uh, kind of. That's me. That's the player saying, I am saying that. Mistake says that. <laughs> Zug literally went, well, it looks like your pet sucks. You should have got a better pet. Like, my dog died. Well, you should have got a better <laughs> dog. Dude. Pets poodle. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what this is? here's a purebred. Yeah, what's your... Uh, <laughs> Plus your cannon do it. It activated to move and activate as part of the same bonus action. Let me see the activation, because I don't see it in the um... You mean like this? Yeah, like that though. Oh, okay, ten, ten. Uh yeah, that will also Yep, okay, cool. Here we go. And uh no. 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 Hey, there we go. Yippee! So, some some temporary. Uh, some of you guys have twelve temporary Juice. hit points. The eight will not override that. Dude, I just nice. want to say, fuck the old eldritch like ballistic cannon. I like this one more. This one's cool. People love protector. People love protector. protector. Cool, protector cool. But protector I'm pretty low on DPS power. without it. Yeah. True, and we are missing a DPS in Mido, buddy, because he keeps picking at his. And eye. we're missing Drask. We're missing um, Drask. But we did get. But we do players. have AOEs, and I keep pushing enemies into the AOEs. Bo, it's your turn. Um, so Bo can't really do anything else without dropping concentration. So maybe he's just gonna move here, behind. And I think I'm gonna move my moonbeam to the left one, so that if it's easier to be pushed into, yeah. I think I'll that just do that. That definitely works. That definitely works. I think I think that's my turn. I don't think it deals. Does it deal damage again? I always get moon. It doesn't deal damage up. when it passes over someone. Okay. Uh, only when they only when it's cast game. on them, or they start their turn in it. Ah, uh, that's yeah. what it was. I remember we did that for all. Games. Yeah, like, we did that for so Qua, fun. and he moved it in like a line, hitting every enemy, and just vanquished the entire fucking field. It was the most insane yeah. thing I've all time. I was like, I've, that's we, so cool, and then I had comments that were like, that's not how you move, babe. Oh, <laughs> that's not how you move, babe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm filing a formal complaint. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard Juniper do the voice before. <laughs> I mean, I'm, really pretty, well. I'm pretty reserved unless it's like making fun of people. It's oh, great. <laughs> wow. What a good person. Anyway. <laughs> I'm a great person. Yes. You're so good. This guy's going to hurt right over to your face uh, mm -hmm. and slap down that shimmy. That hits. Ooh, for, that for, hits. For 12 points of damage. That's a hitter. God he, damn. Fell sick. Uh, I have a question about the wording in Seismic Stompers. It says, yes. as an action, you can make a melee weapon attack uh, to all creatures within five feet of you. Does that, is that, that my whole action or because I'm a barbarian, do I still get another melee attack? Uh, so, um, as an, so essentially the seismic stompers is an AOE effect. So if you are, if you have like three people in front of you, for example, uh, mm -hmm. you can make an attack roll on each and every, uh, person. And, uh, give me one second. 
I see what you're saying. Though. Yeah, yeah, you get it? I get it. Okay. I get it. Uh... You get me. It is confusing, right? I mean, I think I'm leaning towards Seismic Stompers is the action. Yes. I mean, so, yeah, the Seismic Stompers is the action. It's sort of mm -hmm. like an AOE option for you. That's, right. that, that's essentially what the Seismic Stompers are. But you are correct. It does kind of fall off a little bit if you have extra attack, which I believe you do have. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, I think my... Hold on. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to move this way. I'll take opportunity, whatever. It's no biggie. You're entering the moonbeam. You'll have to make a constitution saving throw. Oh, I oh I thought it was only like enemies or specific targets. Oh, really? It's no, it's, it's just, a laser. It's 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 yeah. It's a it's a laser coming. Well, from the I sky. could just. No, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna stay here then. Even though she's in rage and she shouldn't be discalculating. Uh, just, and I'll just. <laughs> Just yeah. FYI, because everyone gets one warning. Uh, once you make your move, typically I count it. So just, just, just so you know for the. Picture. Hey, that's cool. I don't mind either way. Uh, oh, you're good. You're good now. I, everyone gets a warning. So. All right. Sure. Uh, that's. Uh, in that case, I'm going to. I think I'm gonna let them expire under the moonbeam, or at least attempt to. And I'll put okay. my two uh, reckless attacks into this Sans Undertale droid. Uh. Uh, that'll hit 14 points of damage. Uh, that's both. Oh, well, God, actually, can attacks... I only do it? Can I only no. do reckless attack once? Okay. No, you can do it both times. Okay. Uh, you, just, you just attacked so fast, I didn't see it. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm on fire here. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's going to be my turn. Okay. Karis. Um, can I go into this space or is that wall? Uh, that you can go into that space, but you'd have to walk here to here to here because if you do a diagonal step you technically count as crossing through the movie oh okay yeah i can do that so that would be how many spaces one two th like five ten fifteen twenty that'd be twenty right. if i went right there okay yeah can, can we assume that i did that <laughs> yeah that's fair okay oh my oh, god hello oh my <laughs> Where did god I go? <laughs> what, you what clipped. happened you clipped <laughs> <Dude>. <laughs> I'm right, in the back rooms now, dude. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, she, she punch. All right, who are you punching? I'm punching this dude right here. You can try. I'm, I'm gonna do. Let's go. Son of a bitch, god damn it. <laughs> <laughs> no, not that one. <laughs> You're getting owned so hard right now. So hard. And then the next no. two going for that one. Bro, stop. No. Quit it. I refuse. <laughs> I refuse. I worked really hard on this guy, stop. No, I refuse. Oh! I refuse! That's a punch. You can inspire nobody because no one's spending their inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> I keep forgetting, okay? <laughs> shut up, shut up, get out of my head! What did I take this tr this feat for? I, I wondered this when we did goblins. Too. I was... I was really, I was really excited for this new inspiration rule, but no one uses it because everyone is hoarding it in the hopes that. What if I got a bigger roll coming up? Oh, yeah, it's that's, more it, useful. that's it. Yeah. I feel like it's more useful for saves though, because if I use it on an attack, I might hit anyway. Yeah, that's that, right. That's it's kind of the thing. It's the indecision, which is kind of funny, honestly. We're just 25, Paralyzed. 30, yep. 35. That's correct. And that'll be my turn. I think everyone just likes having a little clover icon over there. <laughs> okay, this turret. Oh, yeah, you didn't kill my, it's my favorite turret. Uh, I'm gonna roll a 1d4. Uh, one is the bomb, two is the turret, three is Karis, four is Felsic. All right, the bomb. Let's see how many attacks is gonna be shot in your direction. Four. Holy shit! Oh, wait, whoa, okay. slow down, okay. Seth! Okay. <laughs> wait, 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 bomb for the guy. Uh, so is there any, it, your AC is 14, correct? Yeah. Okay, so that's gonna be 7, 18, Holy fuck. 29, 40. One oh these, my god. One of these days, I will knock Tomato Gaming unconscious. That is You'll never do that, deal. and you know it as well as I do. <laughs> Because if I do, I'm pretty much cheating at that point. All right. Yeah, you you know it, dude. 
Uh, the bomb. It's your turn. Uh, the bomb's gonna shoot this guy with a okay. shot right away. I'll tell you what. Mm -hmm. 18 to hit. Hey, where do you want to push him? Uh, well, I'd love to push him into that. You do so. You push this lifeless body into the reeds. <laughs> <as> the, <laughs> beam just... Just, the, the beam is amassing a body count, dude. What the hell? Yeah, and the bomb in a in a fit of rage. I'm going to... Can I squeeze along this wall like this? Sure can. Nice. You're a, you're a fucking slime. The bomb is going to do just that. And then he's going to fucking shoot this asshole that just hit him for fucking a billion damage. Okay. Uh, 13 to hit. Uh, that will hit. Cool. I push him in as well. 13 damage. Uh, nice he... Job, well, uh, he can't. Yep. And pushes in. And then he will roll a constitution saving throw. Uh, he can be moved? He's going to clear it. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's just he he's just a little like he's like your turret. He's got little. Oh, uh, OK. OK. I thought it was like an oh, he's like mounted onto that. No. Yeah. OK. OK. All right. Here we go. Constitution saving throw. <laughs> Great. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> homie got beamed. And he is no <laughs> fucking dead. No one blasts me. Yeah. Now they're just three. Mm -hmm. Four robots cooking in a fucking beam of moonlight right now. It's called teamwork. End of encounter. Woo! I love that combo shit. Mm. Yeah, I wanted to try something that was not bare this time. Oh. Hell yeah. I mean, druids have a lot of really fucking good spells. Druids have a lot of utility. Yeah. Yeah, they're fun. All you right. You can fit a lot into that bad boy. So that's what she said. Hey. hey. <laughs> All right. That was just right for the taking. I'm going to get a Karis... spray bottle and spray later. <laughs> oh my God. Sex jokes in my D&D? &D? Absolutely we should, we should. not. Knock that off now. Knock that off. <laughs> Guys, serious business. We're playing D&D. &D. <laughs> I don't have time adult. for sex. Oh my Thank God. You. No, women and their dice. <laughs> Temp dresses the lot. <laughs> oh Jesus! Uh, as Car you... Karis, like real quick, just like looks over the bomb and just like is kind of concerned, but also isn't sure if he can even bleed. Uh, if you look at the bomb right now, you'd see as he just very steadily and slowly heals uh, all of his thirty missing hit points. As I use all of my radiation regeneration, fuck yeah, uh, dude, to return it all. Yeah, uh, if I use the if I use the regeneration one, it maths out to fifteen. Uh, exactly. Divided down by five. I think it's ma I did the math. Oh, I'd okay. have a little bit left over still. I think you. Yeah, I was about to say you were at twenty two. I was at twenty two. The max I can pull if I let all of the you regens go by remaining. burning three for six. Yeah. Oh, you're, won, oh, you're, oh, yeah. I was have, doing the regen because that's the only uh, way because I don't get double. But if I do the regen one, if we're like not in a fight or something, that's second. technically the most bang for my buck. You are correct. Okay, so 6, 12, 18, 24, 36. That's six points that you spend. I'm pretty sure. Yep. And there's nine. You have nine points remaining. It'll so you're a, fine it, it, then. It takes a couple of minutes, but yes. Wait, no, it should be all of them, Brett. Because I only get, if I spend three points of radiation regeneration, I get six HP total from the three turns of that regen. Oh, that's, so if I spend that's, all of that's it. That's where the double's coming from. Yeah. You, yes. You, have, you actually have one point remaining. Here's one. Okay. You have one point because 22, uh, 28, and if we're doubling up, that's 14. So that'll be, uh, you have one point every uh, radiation regeneration left. I'm fine. I cannot die. All right, then. Uh, so we know the way is always left. This way. Uh, should we see what's on the right? It I, uh, looks I like a dead end. I suppose. Yeah, you're just like staring all the way down there and you just immediately see that it's all here. Um, I can't see shit. I'd rather not risk more turrets, if I were to be honest. What if one of you were stealthy about it? 
<laughs> I've never been the stealthiest of uh, path walkers. He's like, takes a step forward and clanks heavily in his fucking <laughs> scrap armor. <laughs> I'll do it. Is Bo stealthy at all? Because of his like lengthy limbs? I mean, Bo uh, can be a rat. Uh, I'm checking your stealth. Yes, you can also be a rat. Yeah, but that would waste. Like, what if we were at a boss and I just That's wasted true. on the rat? True. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, I am a firm believer in the short rest before entering big rooms club. Okay. I just can turn into a rat so. and then scope the area out, short rest, and get my thing back. Short rest is yeah. more, and time is of the essence. Yeah, it do look a little barren back there. Let's just skip it. Let's just go. Can I do a perception check, maybe, if I see anything? It's fucking miles away, so I'll have to, like, crit or whatever. But uh, just, like... You, you can do an investigation, yes. Oh, <laughs> don't mind if I do. <laughs> you know I love to investigate. Uh, so, I will give you the above uh, the above table uh, answer instead of the dramatic DM answer. Uh, so, these pipes over here control uh, the heating of the room that was up to the north, which was over here. Uh, they were already in release, but if you sealed them up, it would cause this room up here to overheat, forcing this door to automatically open. However, because you managed to shut down the server with the dust of corrosion, all the doors are open, so you don't have to worry about that. Oh, yeah, never mind. I see what we could have done there, but we don't need to. Bye bye. Anything cool to scrap on these guys? Ooh. Go ahead and give me some uh, engineering. Give me uh, four uses of the engineering tools. Ooh. We'll give a. We'll do us. We'll do a, a, a scrap count. Any oil in there that I can use to make beer? <laughs> Go ahead and do a, <laughs> oh do my a brewer's God. tool. Brewer's tool check. You absolutely can. I mean, consider the fact that Scrap Town Special. Is yeah, I mean, if Lawland's gonna keep engineering oil. tools, I'm going in there, dude. I'm, yeah. gonna, I'm gonna get Locked my up. own provision. Yeah. Provisions up. Yeah, we're getting fucked up tonight. Woo! Yeah, go ahead and do the brewer's tool. Seventeen. Tools. Oh, uh, three more times, please. Oh, you want me to do the full lap too? Oh, okay. absolutely. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, yes. Yeah, so you will gain the following. I'm just gonna do a, a scrap count. Anything left over, give it to me. I need to make things. The bomb says to Zug vaguely. That is vague. I'm do. I'm in my mysterious arc. Oh yeah, I had a badass arc. I was supposed to be on. Yeah, whatever. Okay. The bomb, oh my the God, bomb yeah. nods to Zug. It's all me. <laughs> all right. So just doing some additions here. Good rolls all around on my 50-sided dice that clearly exists here in this realm. Uh, 40, 45, and 37. Uh, Zug, you receive 140 credits worth of scrap that you can be using for your tech. And then for the bomb, I'm brewing for you, man. Please, God. You I get nothing. Success you successfully tap oh, oh, uh, the the motor oil and like the all the fluids that these machines have uh, in all four of them. So here we go. Uh huh. Uh, ooh. ooh. Hey, you did good. You did good. Uh, so I'm proud of you. Thirty-one. I'm so happy. And thirty-six. So <laughs> this is where it's fucked. Uh, you receive. Um, I'm just gonna call this. Uh, Construct fluid. Um, Vague and fun. I like the sound of that. Brewing. Well, I mean, it's like it, you know how like cars have all, like yeah, yeah, oil, gasoline, like like I was gonna say radiation, like radiator fluid. You know, it, it's it's just like a combination of all the various bits and bops and coolants and stuff like that that keeps these things flowing. Uh, but you get a hundred and twenty-four. Bread is worth of construct fluid. Oh, damn. Headlight fluid. Damn. Did I, I didn't say headlight fluid, did I? Two, did I say headlight? No, anyways, go on. Anyways, continue. Um, yeah, so you guys will head over here. Oh, oops. Can you put that down on my money sheet or something? Already I, I, did. Winky face. Okay. It's in your Thank inventory you. under scrap. Yeah, big. If you're trying to find the amount that you have, you can press the... Uh little notepad edit item thing and it'll show you the amount well, your man, price what is what it will be there yeah. okay so before 
Now, um, I'm just going to move you back here, Bo, because this is a giant pit. And Classic <laughs> Bo throwing Hell himself yeah. into the hole. <laughs> and uh, Karis is currently balancing on some rails that is hovering over this giant pit. And oh, I love being me? here. Can I do an investigation check? You absolutely can. Uh, thank you, Wisdom, Charisma, Dexterity. What? Uh, I will be under your skills for investigation. Oh, I always forget that. That's okay. What are you investigating? The ground. I just, I just went. Nope. I changed my mind. Mm -hmm. I just. I'm trying to investigate the air to see if we can hear any more robots down the way. Ooh, I see. Uh, go ahead and give me instead a perception check. Perception check. Okay. Even better. Surprisingly enough, you do not hear the marching of robots down this way. Thank God. Um, I'd like to investigate the rails and see, like, if one seems more, like, um, structurally sound than the other. Go ahead and roll that investigation. Uh, it is structurally, they both are structurally sound. As you're looking through this, you'll actually see that this minecart over here uh, seems to be attached to some magnet uh, rails. It was meant to move on its own. However, because once again, you have disabled uh, the server, uh, these do not automatically move. Above Ooh. board, above board uh, you, were, you uh, guys were gonna have to juggle between the two rails as these things were moving at a high speed, charging back and forth, back and forth, so you constantly <laughs> had to figure out which side you yes. wanted to go on. But you disabled all of that, so that's not happening. <laughs> that's fucking Sorry really for funny, ruining though. your dungeon. No, 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 no. Hey, are you kidding me? It's, we this, broke it, guys. This is this is what uh, D and is all about: is figuring out alternative solutions to your issues. So, <laughs> echo off the distance. Yeah. yeah. So, what? Uh, through. Mm. What? What? Did they just <laughs> say? What? what did they say? <laughs> what did you say? Are you Pommel just zooming at me in the darkness? <laughs> okay. Let's hey, get does... moving. It won't can, break. Can I? Can I still push this even though it doesn't automatically go? Uh, so when you try to apply some weight, it's currently magnetically sealed to this. But perhaps you can uh, disable the magnetic seals so that it can go in a free roam pattern. Yeah. I'm gonna try that at, at least once. Okay. Are you gonna go push your sec? Give me a. Uh, t uh, give me. <laughs> go ahead and, and check the. Use the. Uh, your tools. Your engineering tools for that. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> wow, that's a death trap. Uh, so Rough. you. Oh boy, here we go. You so have inspiration. Well, never mind. It's no, time. Know. I'm gonna pause this because something <gasps> really funny is about to happen. Oh, as God. you spark yes. with the engineering tools, you Bo's see it dead. flare up to light as it then goes. No. Oh my Bo's God. Fucking yeah, you're dead. Bo's fucking dead. Bo, as you're walking along as safety as you can, this minecart uh, comes at you at an alarming and dangerous speed. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? It's been a fucking pleasure. Think Bo. quick. Have... Think Please fast. Please make a dexterity saving You throw. have inspiration. Yeah, you. This is an you have inspiration, yeah, and if you don't use it, I'm gonna ask Brett to change my fucking feet. I swear to God. <laughs> okay, I will use my inspiration for this moment okay. for my dexterity. What the hell is happening? Okay, well, and the cart is becoming more and more cursed, just like Bo. It's just stretching and it speeds up. <laughs> it's so gross. Uh, yeah, it's okay. smearing. I fixed it. Uh, dexterity check. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you have advantage. So. Oh, do I click it with advantage? Sorry. Yeah, you got your called you, inspiration. You gonna, did, yeah, you, you. I forgot how to do call, that. No, it's okay. You didn't call inspiration. I can't. They totally did. They, they did. Totally I did. They did, though. Oh, you did? 100%. Yeah, they, yeah, I don't know how to do it. it. It's not like it matters, though. Uh, yeah. Uh, so that's your inspiration roll. Okay. So. Apologies. Inspiration spent. Concentration over because the movie is not there. Okay, so here's the, you're not gonna get knocked off. This thing is gonna go ahead and like, 
it's gonna hit you pretty hard and then keep on going. Uh, you do not successfully dodge the minecart, but it doesn't knock, you didn't fail so bad where it would have knocked you in the pit. So you take six points of legendary damage as it continues on its way, moving uh, really fast. It just kind of keeps doing. Uh, I cannot believe what Zoe has done to me. Did we hear the impact from around the corner? Oh yeah, you hear a and uh, It sounds like winches. you killed Bo. <laughs> <laughs> and then you will hear the minecart crash as it uh, escapes the uh, rails. That was the sound of Bo getting destroyed by that. Oh my cart. god! <laughs> Bo, are you? I barely even going? did anything. Like he's just like he's holding his. He got up. hit. Like... <laughs> oh, are they god. alive? Like, like badly. You okay? He's not responding. Not what the fuck? He's <laughs> not responding. I, well, I guess I could always try to revive another animal. Dr. Oshi looks over Someone at go over there. Dr. Oshi looks over at Zug and then we'll just say, uh, oh, good work clearing the minecart. You should make it easier <laughs> for us. <laughs> He's... God, I hate that guy. You could have just left it. <laughs> Karis uh, looks at doc Dr. Oshi. Check on the rackling. Oh, wait. Oh. Dr. Oshi <laughs> rushes up over to Bo. Bo, are you all right? Bo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Got a boo boo. <laughs> He's fine. He's still it off. And they're crying. <laughs> I got hit for 40. <laughs> uh, let's, uh, let's go ahead and check out that hit point bar. All right. Uh, so, uh, Dr. Oshi will lean over and be like, all right, I'll have, to, I'll have to see the wounds. It looks painful. You're writhing in pain. Let me, uh... Right, uh, Bo, this is... This Jesus is, Christ. This is a uh, superficial wound, but if you'd like, I can go ahead and heal you. Uh, however, it will require an infusion of radiation. Right on. They're used to it. Uh... No, it's okay. I couldn't walk it off. Yes. <laughs> and, and he nods and he goes, Yes, yes, you can. You're fine. I think Both slowly got slink bruised. slinks away, but like one arm is all slinky and his other foot is slinky, but like one of them's short and he's kind of like disoriented. <laughs> Are you sure he's fine? He's fine. He says, That's like he sighs. He just goes, He's fine. Hmm. Wait, wait a second, wait a second. I could have fallen into the pit, though. That could have been a thing. It could yeah, but you didn't. You it got hit with six didn't. damage instead, though. <laughs> Which is kind of where kind of where we're all just like, you're good. Man, I'm curious about the pit situation. Okay. Probably would You'd be died. dead. Oh. Yeah, probably okay. death. If we can't see the bottom with dark vision, it's probably a 90-foot fall or something. And uh... oh. Actually, Brett. Yeah. Can the bomb see the bottom? I have much longer dark vision range than everyone else. Uh, uh 120 from here. Uh, no, you cannot. Okay, yeah, that's pretty fun. <laughs> Man, I wonder what Zeg would have done if I fell in the pit. Jesus Christ. Probably, like, shrugged heartlessly <laughs> and then moved on with his life. That's not true. He would have felt eternally guilty if you fell, but now it's like, whatever. Uh, can Karis try to listen out in this area? Yeah, go ahead and do a perception check. You will also notice um, a giant gate over to the south with red lights. As you're doing that check, uh, Dr. Oshi will walk over and be like, I think this is it. I think this is the entrance to the mainframe. And that will, and he kind of like walks up over this. That should grant us access to it in, in, in Auckland Court. As you listen out with your perception check, you will see dropping down from the sky. Oh, God. Ever so slowly. I must pause for this, I'm afraid. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Love it when he pauses, dude. In an absolute dramatic fashion. Mulder oh. will slowly drop down from the sky. Attached to wires, you will see these rather grandiose and dramatic wings of an angel as he slowly descends down this metal 
this this sort of like this sort of like perfect metal beam. He gently lands, looking at each and every one of you. It is time, my monsters. It is time to bring peace to this world. Peace in our times. You have stopped me so many times that this should be our final. And just then you see- Do you promise? As you say that, <laughs> just then you see from the ceiling, a slimy tentacle <laughs> stabs Mulder through the chest. Oh. oh. What? And you'll look up and you'll actually see a, 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 a giant pile of slime over up on the, uh, up on the ceiling as it drops into the lifeless body of Mulder. You'll watch as the slime just just forms around this metallic body. Stop as, that. As Boulder begins to break apart. Oh, you'll only hear a guttural voice. Leaves no time. Peace in our times. Huh. As you will have to face off against the dreadful Hecaton Molder. How many times we gotta teach you this lesson, old man? <laughs> Next time on Pipe Dreamers. Get real. Molder's basically our team rocket at this point. He just Ooh, never. Definitely. Gotcha. I, I kind of love like this man. <laughs> Well, I've got some good news and some bad news. It probably is the same. Uh, this is your final encounter with Mulder. He's been severed from the Junk Pile Junction. Uh, you've destroyed mo most of the Junk Pile Junction. And the people that moved him here uh, for the automated mining uh, essentially brought the last fragment there. And then uh, the slime that was hiding in here is now going to use Mulder as a, a lovely little Mulder suit to face off to you guys, face off with you guys. So we will see what happens next time. And we're gonna get some okay. brand, and we're gonna get some brand new art as well for the, the, the slime molder. Be a good I have to ask, Miss Say, how, how mm -hmm. do you feel about day one? I I'm into it. Yo, I vibe. This is a good vibe. Yeah. <laughs> Karis not so much. I think Karis hates you all, but you know. <laughs> hey, that's, hey, that's, hey, that's cool. <laughs> that, that, that brings drama and content, it's okay. That's Hell yeah, did you dude! Just say I, that I'm, I'm. Drama and content. Did you just say? That? Hell, I did. Hell yeah, I did. It's all about the content. <laughs> proud. A little bit proud. content. Proud, proud, proud. Yo, you guys are great though. Thank you for having me along for this uh, infiltration. Thanks for have lending us your punches. Yeah. Um. Did you guys? I got more of them. Did you guys have fun today? Yes. This is a great mm -hmm. session. Good, good, good. I love today's session. Yay! Glad I'm gonna be real with you. I really, really loved the like collaborative vibe of last time where we all both groups met but yep. my brain couldn't process like 60 percent of what was happening that's why I we just... only we only do that once we, we only do that every once in a while because 11 people is a lot and it's a lot to balance yeah. as well so yeah, it is we, it was fun we try the best that we can uh all right bingo bongo bingo bango bingo bongo bingo bingo wait that's that's fan art. We don't want fan art. We want bingo. I mean, we do want fan art, but yeah, we'll do uh, some bingo here. Uh, ah, here we are. Oh, whoops. I will also share it here in just a moment. Okie dokie. Yeah, I'm glad you guys had fun. These uh, these sessions have been fun to, fun to get put together, but also incredibly stressful, just to make sure that everyone's having a good time. <laughs> also lining everything up, you know what I mean? Um, yeah. So, but I'm glad you guys had fun. Man, this spooky, creepy wind is mellowing my vibe. <laughs> All right. Uh, Pipe Dreamer season two, episode fourteen. Within the myth, uh, fourteen. God, yeah, we've had twenty to twenty-five. Yeah, we had like twenty-four, twenty-five episodes of Pipe Dreamers. That's insane. Let's generate the code. Can you screen share, please? Oh my god, I forgot! God, I said I was gonna do it, and then I didn't do it! <laughs> oh, <God>. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Get owned. I did. I'm, I'm so owned, dude. Owned. Uh, fate die. Yep. Dwarf NPCs in the mine. Nopers. The miners get scammed again. 
You know what? Was there a Minecraft I mean, reference? Did we not do a... Huh. I would have Minecraft referenced if I didn't feel like Drask, shit. Drask would right. have because he has the mining voice. pick. Yeah. Oh. No Minecraft reference. This is unfortunate. Muscle... Was there muscle bonding? I know Felsic kind mm, of bonded. There was right? muscle acknowledgement. Yeah, there there was some acknowledgement. That's but... bonding. Suck it up. That's bonding. <laughs> no. I, I, it's, I, it's up to Juniper and Massey. It's up It's up to them if they... I, they... Think, I think it counts because... Sure, like, sure. In, inspiration. There was inspiration Yeah, involved. that's true. All right. Nat 20. Uh, yep. Uh, my son is dead. Nope. I fucking wish this time, dude. It counters <laughs> the big bad in the mine. So I don't know what the big bad references to, but I'll check that off because there was a big bad, which is Mulder being a stinky poo poo robot guy. Uh, the party tries to loot ores and gemstones. No. They fight mining equipment, defensive equipment like guard bots do not count. No. Nope. What? That's, what a weird speculation because that would have been a check mark, but there it is. Another Ganymedian slime. Yep. Oh, she reveals more lore. Nope. So, Masay, uh, if this other personality of Karis could have a hit list, who are the top three from the groups? Go! Right now! Uh, Victor, Hellebore, and, uh, and, uh, Logan. Okay, great. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> uh, I said other groups. You aimed specifically at your one. That, uh, that counts. That counts. That counts over there. Okay. Uh, Nat 1. Yep. Bomb progresses and radiation mastery. Uh, no purse. That did not happen. Every day of his life. He's always <laughs> progressing. Zug finishes a project. He tried, but he is sadly gone. No new mutation today. Uh, return of Gorilla Miter did not happen. Lesser restoration was not used. Boy, howdy. Was <laughs> there Boy, was darker. there. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Juniper. I appreciate Juniper <laughs> just being like, yeah, can we move this along? I really don't want to be the one holding everybody. <laughs> so... Uh, Karis is stressed with her new party. Is Karis I would imagine so. There was some regret, but I don't know about like <clears throat> stress. She hasn't she hasn't been stressed out yet. No. Does Karis miss her old party? <laughs> you know uh, what? Dash is in there. Yes, she does. Uh, okay, there it is. <laughs> it's like Summer's like staring into the chat right now, just being like. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, DM wins, uh, boy. I felt like I didn't have a lot of win moments to, today, you know what I mean? I definitely but you, had some- But you, you yelled at, you yelled at <laughs> us to not move. That's uh, a that DM a win. Lot. No, your DM win was, um, yeah, yeah, when you, when we were end of combat and we moved and then you were yeah. like, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, yeah, class, yeah, I didn't yeah. say class was dismissed. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah All right, class is dismissed. Class is dismissed, let's go. I oh almost my. fell in a hole, you saved me. Dr. Oshi and Kara situation escalates. I, I, I mean, we squared up, but... I don't, I don't think it escalates. I think it didn't it's still, escalate. It, it's still at the same level. It's just more of like, hey, maybe they misunderstand. No, 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 they definitely... No, are. sizing <laughs> each other up still. Yeah, uh, none of my business. They're in full, <laughs> full thing there. Okay. All right. It is fan art time. Fan art, fan art, yeah. fan art. I love fan art too freaking fart, much. Fart, fart, we're fart. starting strong. This no, one's for yeah, Barry. We're starting oh strong. hell yeah! <laughs> oh my god, uh, we've got more Animu. Um, beautiful Zug. baby boy. Ah. Beautiful baby boy. Dude, nice. I love that. God, look at him, proud father. I love that. <laughs> This fucking look. He took my game. game. <laughs> That's fucked up. And Paris is just ready to protect. T posing. <laughs> I hate this and I love this combo. <laughs> He's fucked. Yeah, really big hammer D8. Roll a D12. If it lands a center higher, add a D6. And all again, if it rolls nine or lower. Poggies! I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm sorry! What did you say, Felsic? <laughs> Got him, chat, Pog. I'm a consumer, and it's... I live in shame every day of my life. Oh, we've got... Uh, wholesome Care More, which we haven't seen in quite some time. And Young Bo Art. Look at Young Bo! Young baby Bo! Oh, baby boy! Hey, that's, that's me. Oh. <laughs> 
before he became stretchy. The PKL one is still my favorite Mido buddy. Yeah, I, I hope that no one ever includes a fucking new one in anything. This one's. <laughs> it's, it's I want him to be forever in like the corner, like the farthest away drawn character of just the confused. The confused one. One. My, my favorite is still the music player one. The first oh. one. The very first one. The one. very first. Hey yo, Karis. Hey yo. Hey yo. Hell yeah. Give me them. Give me them arms. All right. Let's see what we got here. Um. Oh yeah. I guess some of these do include. Uh. This would be. Oh wait. This is... Yeah. The muscle gang. <laughs> As everyone's running up, getting ready to go. Oh, uh, we've got. Oh, this one. Oh, this one's called. Uh, let's see, Felsic and Dra Felsic and Drask versus Karis, and it's a Putus Extreme reference. I don't know what that means. Is that an anime? I don't know what it is either. I don't know either. It's okay, but it looked good. Hey. Oh shit. Orc Commando <laughs> Drask and Orc Mech Zug. Hell yeah, dude. That's what's in the 40k universe. Cool. Corn Berserker. Uh, oh, and it's all, it is all 40k. Yeah, it's all 40k. Hell yeah. Oh, dang. Wait, what is slime going to be? I don't know, but we're going. We're oh. The oh. <laughs> <laughs> Joking on spaghetti. Right, poor boy. And we're doing more orc mech. More orc mech. Fuck yeah, dude. That's my final form. We gotta get up. Did anyone is, guys? Oh, never mind, is, never mind, is, never mind. Is that your final form or is this your final form? Dude, what? <laughs> so I, I, after somebody was doing uh, hair work and, and practice stuff, I let them know what is under the hood. And uh, yeah, this fucking nailed it. This is this, great. This, this, is, this nice. is fucked up. It's fucked up. <laughs> why, why, why is it fucked up? Please, please explain. <laughs> no. Please, why, I'm why is not it, going to elaborate. Why is it fucked up? I, I need to know. Is it, is this fucked up as well? <laughs> I like Dang. that one. Or is this fucked up? I mean, I don't oh. know. Which, which oh my goodness. Oh, no, everyone. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. Okay, so oh, no. he's progressively um. getting so fucking hot. Holy <laughs> oh. Jesus Christ. Oh, oh no. <laughs> hey, remember that nerd in high school? Well, here he is now. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Bo's oh. looking too. This uh, this YouTube video is called Zug Mental Health PSA. Let's go. Ahead and do <laughs> <laughs> you aware of your mental health brand? The strongest warriors must always know themselves before any battle. <laughs> it was really good. No can be taught alone. <laughs> They're never in really shame in seeking out someone who knows the enemy who is fighting. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Holy wow. shit. <laughs> that is so gross. Even the enemy with him. Like, it's just the level of <laughs> shit posts that was made for this oh, video. So, good. so impressive. Like, I love that. Love, uh, <laughs> like, the video editor, the, 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 the tearing, just so good. Um, oh, well, uh, well, look at, oh. Oh, okay. oh my god! Who made, who made this hey, one? Yeah. I, oh, I, I, don't, I don't know. Who made this look so, it's, 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 it's Juniper, guys. I'm playing. Hey, I made it. Juniper. You, you made that? Dude! Yeah. Hey, yo! Oh my god! That's super good. Damn. Yeah, she's hot. I was going to say that was unironically one of my favorite ones I've seen of her. And, uh, Thank you! you That's great. Thank you. That is now, super is, good. Is that your Am favorite I changed... one? Or? Or is this your favorite one? <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. I, lo I love that so good. <laughs> Hey, Toots, you see Slime Guy around? No, why? I want to try something. What's, what are you going to- Wait, what is that? What are you going to yeah, get what is that? you little monster? What is what that, is you that? little freak? Enhance. <laughs> Enhance. Enhance. I mean, it looks, 
It looks like poison. It's like, just death. It does okay. look like poison, yeah. Just death poison, okay. <laughs> I do, I, uh, hold on, I'm just really liking this, like, artifacty looking bow right here. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's really cute. I kind of miss old bow. You guys should have bought the You can always uh, lesser restoration I yourself. I was about to say, you can go back to old uh, bow anytime you want. Literally whenever you want. You, you don't Sometimes. even have to ask anyone. You can do it Truly. yourself. <laughs> you just be like, I'm sick of this. <laughs> just do it. <laughs> right on. <laughs> Point. Hey. Aw, two beautiful dads. That's adorable. Uh, if Pikel Mido got a chance uh, to go for a battle. There it is. <laughs> uh, Did she heal with like guns? What, what, what? I don't actually know the. Well, they have like the strongest cantrip in the fucking campaign. Mm. That's true. So they were Slime more of a damage cleric. You must really hate the fact that you have have uh, hair, red hair, about now, right? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a little bit, slightly. Uh, oh yeah, we already Amazing. saw. We, we saw the work in progress of the berry. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's see here. This is just a shit post. You guys decide who's who, right? <laughs> no, I, I know who's who. I, I know who's who. Come on, come on, guys. <laughs> oh my god. You let me know, okay? I'm loving this sketch pad, by the way. Just like looking around at this. this Yo, that's, yeah, that's super fun. good. All Living. my children are either dead or dying. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, true. <gasps> bird, did you finish the animation? Oh my god. Have you guys seen this animation bird made? No, I have oh, not. I, have I haven't. I thumbed over anime? it and saw that it was almost eight minutes long. Eight is that okay? I mean, we ended early. Uh, we did. Yeah, it's early enough. I'm gonna go ahead and turn this. We should absolutely watch this because the little that I did see of it was really fucking sick. So let's go ahead and see what we got here. Oh, do I hear like, do I hear like birds? Yes. Uh, you see a seagull flying overhead. Oh, let's go like take out some rations and toss them out for the seagull. I'm gonna uh, ritual cast speak with animals. Uh, you'll watch as this bird just comes flying by and starts to- I miss that boy. Wait, I, need, I need to ask you something. Uh, it turns around over to you. Hey. Hey. Uh... How are you talking to me? Oh, uh, anyways, hey. I need to ask you something super important. <laughs> and if you That's me my favor, favorite phrase. I will give you literally whatever your little seagull heart wants, okay? So a don't gun. just leave me. What? A gun. A, you want a you want a gun? We have huh? guns. <laughs> Barry yeah. has many enemies. Fuck, dude! I could totally hook you up with a gun. Okay. That would be so awesome. Well, now we're talking. Last night, did you see? a big trashy ship get picked up and get sort of flown out by a bunch of, bunch of other like really more expensive looking ships. Hey! Oh yeah, I saw that. Can you try to fly downtown and see if you can find that junk ship? If you do this, Barry wants two guns. What? <laughs> Barry, how are you going to carry two guns? Please work with me here. You gave me the shittiest food possible, and now you're asking me to go on some weird oh, espionage so movie for you? I eat that shit like every day, Barry. Well, it's probably why you look malnutritioned. Who's What's Barry? she doing out there? <laughs> <laughs> I would have given you a gun. She's going to give the bird a but, gun? But, but, but... <laughs> Well, I got okay. a little heated, okay? I just, I, you know, you could talk bird. It was really weird. You're hey, asking you know, me to I go ahead and find I... your big old metal oh, bird. This is a psycho. strange thing, okay? I'm sorry, Barry. Hey, I had kind of a stressful evening. Um, I hope you're doing, you're, are you doing all right, though? Are you having an okay morning? Oh, uh, now was, you're asking, because I pressured you into it. This is unbelievable. <laughs> uh, Barry! Oh, all right, look, who you want? <laughs> I just want to find our ship. Give me a rough idea of where we can find it. Okay. Barry will do this. However, you got this strange plasticky chips that's in your pocket right now. I you find this very money? weird. She'll sit down with Barry for a little while and outline the basics of exchange and even offer him some of her credits. Gotcha. So you like that money then, yes? Yeah, it's good. Okay. I want you to go over to the ocean and throw 500 of it in there. 
What? Barry, why? Just prove to me that you're loyal to Barry, and then I'll do this shit. for you. This fucking bird is mad as hell, dude. Do we have a deal? Yeah, we have a deal. And she like holds out her hand, and then she's like, wait. And then she like takes her hand back. Okay. He broke her and deal with that. All right, <laughs> then. And Barry will land okay. on your head and then be go like, up, up, and away. Let's see you throw away that precious gas. <laughs> she, did she just... I was going to have to what? throw it away some way or another since nobody seems to want it and I don't know how to spend it. I thought everyone <laughs> wanted this, though. I have low standards for life, Barry. Oh, my oh that's God. I don't need I don't need expensive things, Barry. I just I mean, need a wheel. Would, be, would it be better if you like threw less away? Would you feel better about that? Yeah, I feel a little better. Oh, well, Barry doesn't care. Go ahead and throw five hundred in the water. <laughs> okay, Barry. God, I collect all of this out. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, what God. just happened? I don't know. I was so invested. She said she could talk to animals, but that was just talking at an animal. Anyone can do that. Yes. Drask, as you slowly arrive, you'll see. <laughs> she's walking with her head down, but it's not because she's about to throw away money. She just feels very defeated. <laughs> she is, she's submissive. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and she, she, she will hold out her hand and... <laughs> allow 500 credits to trickle out into oh, the water. Oh, what? Oh, wow. Uh, was, that a, was, was that a lot? This is so important. I'm talking like <laughs> everybody's life's defense on this very. Well, now that you have shown me and proved your worth, it'd be pretty fucked up if I flew away now and never came back, right? Very, it would be so fucked well, up. Well, you've got nothing to worry about, for I will do what you asked. You have entertained me so graciously and it fed me shitty food, but you know what? I don't really care the quality of the food. Don't. No. That's awesome. Neither do I. Give me a cardinal direction. Oh, go, go south. Uh, go, go south. Okay. I'm so, I'm so alone. No, you're not. You've got Barry. Barry likes have... watching you do stupid shit. It's very entertaining. <laughs> Okay, she's gonna lay down and curl into the fetal position. <laughs> well, that reminds me of when I was just a small little hatchling. <laughs> All right, here I go, off to the south. Um, so let me get this straight. You just want me to fly south, and if I just keep no, going till Barry. I see the bird? No, Barry. <laughs> you, you, you have to know what the city is, Barry. This is the main city. Can you please just examine the main, the city? Don't go, don't go much further. Don't go into Veshar. I mean, Arkmon. I don't know. I don't know what this map is. I've never set foot out of, out of fucking. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here. Easy, 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 easy there. Okay. This isn't. You're kind of ruining Barry's buzz right now. This is not okay. You're just kind of losing it. All right. Okay, I'm tell, sorry. Tell you what. No, it's okay. We all have bad days. Tell you what. I'll look around here in this area. You, I won't go beyond the mountains because you told me not to. I'll see if I see a big metal bird around. And if I do, I'll just let you know. And it'll probably take me a day or so. I'll let you know. I'm good to go, okay? I'll try to have some better food for you when you get back. No, 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 look. A massage. Is there anything else I can do for you? There's nothing. No, I really, I want nothing from you. I want absolutely nothing from you. It's not even fun anymore. It's just sad. I was truly socially hacked by a one HP trigger. You're still pushing on this. I'm, I'm, you want look. me to cry? No, 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 please. No. Oh, my God. No, listen, listen, Barry's gonna also just find you something, okay? Just stop being so sad. Thank you, Barry. Would it help you're if you... Barry, it, yeah? Barry, you're a really good friend. I'm not. I'm an asshole, and you just <laughs> fell for it. Oh, but I've, oh. I've changed I've changed my ways because you're just really sad right now. Would you like can to pat just, me on the can head? Can we just pretend, Barry? Can't we just pretend that we're friends? We don't have to pretend. Okay. Because we are. Oh, my ba God, Barry. Right, so, um... Yes, I'm gonna go friend. now. And, um, yeah, you just, uh, hey, you work on you, you know? This is toxic. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, bye. Scream! Speaking of animals is the most toxic spell I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> that was so Where's my, oh my, oh my god. god. It seems like a. Where's my. Oh. 
ever made oh my god oh my god I, 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 I look forward to bird animations every time there is one i'm like oh yes my god. Bird. wait so did he find the ticket or not no. yeah he did but then he fucking exploded before he could tell us we don't know if he did he never confirmed he uh, said he made a what the fuck I didn't <laughs> say to kill him. I just rolled yeah. a nat woman. I tried to grab him as he tried to. Well, see you him. you told uh, Mito buddy in gorilla form. Hey, stop him! <laughs> and then I and then and then I rolled to see how strong he would have gripped it, and with uh, it being unfavorable below a ten, I rolled a one and went. Well, that's probably the worst uh, possible outcome that could happen, and it was just completely crushed uh, Barry. <laughs> Holy oh, shit. Like 500 God. credits. You know, for death. you know, watching that. And here's the thing Barry had like found a really valuable necklace for mm -hmm. as like a as like a peace offering. No, it's yeah. okay. I still have like a hundred credits left over from the necklace. Oh, the my. revivify also cost three hundred credits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I really included that in the calculation. Barry was a giant, and yeah. So I mean, you net a hundred. That was pretty good. Just yeah. just eight hundred credits. Game going, dude, huh? Felsic cannot oh fucking get God. a dub. <laughs> Jesus Christ! It was close. It was. Ah, uh, yeah. Watching that, I must have blacked out uh, being Barry because I'm like, wow, what a psycho bird. Jesus. No, dude, bird. it was really good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, dude. All right, we got a... Oh, this I'm here for inspection. Aw. Is that a brand new fan artist I see? Thank you, Sushi. Uh, we have... Uh, here we go. Happy Camper's Guide. Uh, made a quick sketch of uh, Masay's Karis reading. Uh, this was a reference to the phrase that Masay always used, is starting from the campfire oh. stage, entering Let's Play of We Love Katamari. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, wow. Yo, that's ye old reference. That was like a, actually 10 years ago. Oh, my God. Yikes. Um, uh, oh. I feel aged. I feel sad because I wish this was happening. <gasps> Whoa. Oh. Aww. I was all at the table playing some D. Yeah, I look like a real, real freak at this real table. Freak. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're oh my the. God, you're, you're the goth girl we invited to D and D. Like, yeah, that's yeah. 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 Hey. Uh, I love this photo. <laughs> Bo bear forever, toots. Bo bear oh forever. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> Oh, muscle lady. Muscle. <laughs> muscle. Suck. Muscle. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my freaking god. Oh my god. Um. Oh yeah. I I know Chainsaw Man. I haven't actually uh, seen that. But here's uh, if uh, Felsic was cha like a Chainsaw oh. Man inspired the Axe Devil. Ooh. Yeah, I love it. How would a slime wear shoes? This is a very important question. Also, <laughs> oh, no. also, Barbie, thank you for the uh, new fan art. Welcome. Oh, boy. <laughs> so, do you really have to be that cursed pre-session? <laughs> Sorry. Oh. <laughs> hey. Uh, hey, it happens. That's a bit of a bit of a deep cut for non-Juniper watchers there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is, is this typical Juniper fashion, would you say? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Oh, hey. looking good, looking good. Shrug. Oh. I don't know. Felsic, oh. Felsic oh. and Ursa Luna. I don't, I didn't know Dude, I was. fucking love bears. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would oh. hug every bear that I saw IRL, which is why I can't ever be let out of this house. Okay. All right. Well, that wraps up today. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll be back next week. Sound good? Yeah. 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 Uh, all right. Thanks, guys. I'll see cool. you then. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.